All right, guys, I know you're waiting. Just give us another minute or so. We are just getting ready. Auction Comics, baby. New start time. Right, guys, what is going on? Vader Ray Jim in the house. We are ready. Just about ready to get started. Just had some chicken nachos. They were so, so good. Oh, this is not what I wanted. Where is it? Here you are. This. Yes. All right, we got some good stuff tonight, guys. We got some good stuff tonight. Thank you so much for being here. Kind of want to start with a giveaway, but not these books. These are the buyer's giveaways. I'll talk about that in a bit. Let me get, let me get a giveaway going. Here we go. second All right. Shabap. hashtag auction comics get it in there for the keyword I'll give away I'll give away something cool oh hello I'll give away this Avengers number one Zerdy. get it in there hashtag auction comics let yourselves be known hit that thumbs up please Raph in the house. Good to see you, brother. Canadian Record Store Day, says Jeddo. Is it now? Is it? All right, guys. I just got a few other things I need to get uh, straightened up. Get it in chat. Hashtag Auction Comics. We're going to do a drawing shortly. We're going to talk about the giveaways tonight and all that good stuff. Thank you so much for being here early. Auction Comics, baby! I believe you have my stapler. All right, we are ready to go. Oh, why don't we start the rules first, actually. Make sure you guys get it in there. Hashtag auction comics. We're going to hit that rules video. I got a nice special song for today. <laughs> oh, it's going to be a fun show. Let's do this. Make sure you get a vote in. Thanos versus Green Goblin. Now, for those of you that are new, it's not who's the most powerful. Because obviously that's Green Goblin. It's... <laughs> <laughs> it's who's your favorite who's your favorite marvel villain Thanos or green goblin we got a good showdown tonight make sure you get your votes in let's uh let's hit those rules here we go i think hang on where is it here it is Someone I used to see, but she 
But let me get to the point. Let's roll another joint. Turn the radio loud. I'm too long to be proud. And you don't know how it feels. You don't know how it feels. Auction Comics, get it in there. That's the giveaway keyword. We're going to do an early giveaway for the early birds. Thanks, everybody, showing up. We are early tonight. Did I mention we're early? That's right. 7 p.m. We're going to go to midnight this evening. I figure instead of just doing five rounds, let's just call it at midnight Eastern time. And, uh, yeah, take it away from there. We'll probably like actually start slowing down around, I'd say, 11.45 because we're going to do some giveaways at the end of the night and do our goodbyes and everything. But nonetheless, hashtag auction comics. Get it in chat. Milton Stapler, premium channel member. I missed it. I'm going to have to go back and say give some proper due respect for our friend Milton Stapler. Thank you so much for being a premium channel member, my friend. Uh, let's see here. What did he say? He said, I actually forgot we get these things. Yes, yes, use them. Shout it out. Show some respect to Milton Stapler. And I think there's a way if I do. Yes, yes, yes. Shabap, that should get it to pop back up. I got to get it like a beta ray bill coming out of the screen. Something something that really shows some class. Milton Stapler, thank you so much. We're going to go say go ahead and say hello to everybody in chat. Make sure you get the hashtag in hashtag auction comics. I do want to get Will in here. We got average Will in on the panel early. Will, thanks for stopping in. Thank you so, so much. Thanks for having me. We're going to have absolutely brother. Will was so kind to take a bunch of my money last weekend uh, at the <laughs> UFC pay-per-views. <laughs> It's like he knew the odds or something. He had those odds just memorized. Yeah. <laughs> no, it was pretty fun. Pretty fun. I haven't seen a UFC paper pay-per-view in a while. So uh, pretty entertaining watching that last week. And uh, yeah. Uh, so thanks for being here. Well, hashtag action comics guys. Once again, get that in there and uh, let's say hello to people in chat. We've got Steve and Spock in the house. What is up, Steve and Spock? So good to see you, my friend. Welcome. Welcome. Let's see who else we've got here. We've got Adam Horry in the house. What's up, Adam? Hashtag auction comics. Whoops. My thing jumped ahead. Uh, Jetto says, Shabab! with the beta ray Jim Hulk emojis. Thank you so much. Jetto. Good to see you. Your package is on the way, my friend, all the way to Canada way up in the arctic circle it's gonna be safe and sound don't worry i put hot pock those little heat packs in there put a bunch of those in there to keep the comics nice and warm raf is a 16 month member raf you are awesome my friend thank you so much for the continued support it's because of you guys that we're able to do giveaways for the buyers giveaways to the chat you guys make this channel the place to be with all the giveaways because of your support. So thank you so, so much. Now, I know he's probably just trolling, but is it really Canadian Record Store Day? I mean, you would know, Jetto. You you would know. Jetto's got the vinyl. 
just so you know, he's got the vinyl. Steven Spock, Milton Stapler, of course. I believe you have my stapler. Indeed, indeed. Average World, yes, thank you for this comment. Well, it says smash the like button, pull up a chair, get your favorite beverage and snack. Let's have a chill, relaxing evening with some comics and goodies. Absolutely. There's Adam Horry again. Good to see you. Good to see you. Awesome. Yes, thank you again, Milton Stapler. Yeah, hell yeah, Jetto. Happy 420. I've got a few uh, 420 songs that I download. I'll play them throughout the night. Uh, let's see if you pick up on them. <laughs> <laughs> L. Green with an E machine in the house, maybe making an appearance later on. Excellent L. Green machine. I dropped my, uh, I dropped the StreamYard link in the auction comics chat. So if you guys want to come in, come in for a round or two or the whole night, whatever you want to do, open, uh, open mic night tonight, and we're gonna just gonna go from from seven to midnight. So Anthony Kirby is awesome. Thank you so much, Anthony Kirby. I hope you're doing well. I haven't seen you in a bit, but I haven't been on as much as I. I want to be really hoping that changes in the near, near future. Uh, L green machine is in auction comics, comic book G man in the house. Good to see you. Comic book G man. Hope all is well with you and yours. Uh, Okinara. Oh, oh, I was thinking about you. Okinawa jarhead. I watched the movie jarhead for the first time last week. Damn. That was good. Intense. I did not like the ending though. I wanted him to see the pink mess, but jarhead. Good to see you, brother. Uh, Anthony Kirby, yes, Anthony Kirby is in. Oh, can I wear Jarhead? I, you won a giveaway uh, not so long ago, like five version variants. They're in your box. They're in your box. Um, Jetto says, yes, it sure is Canadian Record Store Day or Canadian Record Day. Uh, the day after Twa Taylor Swift's album release, she knows how to market. I heard somebody comment on, on, like, she sounds like AI or something like that. I don't know. Don't really listen to Taylor that much. Uh, Gotham Street Shop in the house. What is up, Gotham Street Shop? Good to see you. Welcome, welcome. All right, let's get this show on the road. We've been going for 15 minutes. Let's see what we got here. We've got the hashtag auction comics. Let's do the drawing. Actually, this is what I wanted to do. Shabap. It is for this beautiful Avengers. Number one. Now, you guys know this doesn't include shipping, unfortunately, but it will go in your box for free. And uh, shipping is... I, we try to make it as cheap as possible. So, and uh, yeah, so here we go. Free book going to our friend. Who's it gonna be? It's Gotham. Awesome, Gotham Street Shop. Thank you so much. I'll get this in your box. Thank you so much for being here. And uh, yeah, Shabbat, just like that. Free book. All right, guys, we're going to have more giveaways tonight, of course, but uh, let's get right into it. We've got, uh, oh, actually, before we get right into it, what I want to do is do some, uh, show you the giveaways for tonight. So everybody who purchases from me gets on a giveaway wheel tonight, all right? Let me show the giveaway wheel, because you guys really need to see this. You guys really need to see this giveaway wheel. No, you don't. It's empty. If you buy something, though, you get on it. For every book you purchase from me, except the dollar bull box. Every book you purchase from me gets you on the giveaway wheel. I have a $5 pull box. That gets you on the wheel twice. For every book you get from the $5 pull box, you get two entries on tonight's giveaway wheel. Uh, and then all my other auctions will be winner's choice or whatever. Whatever, However many books you get from every auction gets you one entry. It sounds confusing. I'm probably just all hopped up on caffeine. But let's see here. These are the giveaway books, and I'll just do them in, in random order, I guess. We'll, uh, I'm going to do give away one of these Juggernaut. They're all virgin variants, too. Juggernaut, Gambit, Captain Britain. Let's go, bub. Wolvie. And might be my favorite. I think Jugs is my favorite rogue. So, yeah, we'll be giving these away. Again, get on the giveaway wheel. Get yourself a chance to get some free... Virgin variants. And let's get this thing started. Right meow. All right. We're gonna do a let's just do winner's choice on this one. We'll start at two bucks a book. Two dollars a book. Winner's choice. And we've got did I mark these books? I think it, I did. Yeah. Prepared. Nice work, Jim. Uh we've got some old school wolvie here starting at two dollars. Winner's choice. Uh, starts with 116 in the A spot, 119 in the B spot, 121. Damn, he's taking it there. 
132. One thirty-three. Who the heck is that? And one thirty-four. Got some Wolvie here. Three minutes on the clock, guys. First round of the night. Two dollar winner's choice. Let me know if you want pulls from the pull box. Five dollar pulls. Every book in here is an exclusive. Uh, version variants. All kinds of good stuff in there. Trades. There's, it's loaded. Good, good stuff. $2 winner's choice on these Wolverines. Get yourself some Wolverine goodness. And thanks for being here. Happy Saturday. Hope everybody's doing well. Every book you get gets you on tonight's giveaway wheel. You do not need to be present to win or anything like that. And of course, uh, if you get a pull from the pull box, you get two spots for every pull from the $5 pull box. Armando, I'm just seeing you now, Armando. Yes. Where are you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Good to see you, Armando. Welcome, NWO brother. Sorry, I missed that. Awesome, Gotham. Oh, I see. You're talking to Steve. No worries. And if you want to hook me, hit me up, no worries, too. <laughs> Let's see. We got about a minute left on this one. Comic book G-Man wants to get five pulls. Awesome, G-Man. Five by five. Let's get you 10 spots on the wheel. Shabap, there's our wheel. It has begun 10 spots to comic book G-Man. Let's take a look at his five pulls. If anybody wants to put in a $2 bid on those Wolverines, let me know. Ooh, I love this cover. X-23 Deadly Regenesis number five. Nice hit. Oh, got a, two pulls here. We got uh, Rogue and Gambit number four. Zerdy. And Virgin Variant. Uh, which one is this one? This is a... Uh, Let's see, it's like Spider-Man 2099 Exodus. It's part of a connecting cover series. Those are three. Next up. Ooh, another Virgin variant hitting them. There's some Thor goodness. Did I mark it? I did. Thor number 10 nullified. And last but certainly not least, some beautiful Iron Cat after Del Otto. Very nice. Very nice. Comic book G-Man, those are yours. Good luck on hitting some of the virgin variant giveaways. There are a plenty for you to hit. Did anybody get in? Ooh, let me get the end line down. I don't think anybody bid on the Wolvies. No worries, no worries. Awesome, awesome. All right, there we go, there we go, there we go. Let me turn this back here. No love for the Wolvies. Will, did you want to do a round? Do you want me, do you mind if I go again? Yeah, if you want to go again, go ahead. Awesome, awesome. You. All right. I'm not even gonna, I'm not gonna label these. We're gonna start these at a buck each. Winner's choice. Two minutes on the clock on this one. Do, do kind of a speed round. I got a ton of auctions tonight, guys. Uh, let's see. We've got some Savage Dragon. That's right, Savage Dragon, guys. So let's see what we got here. Savage Dragon number eight. 
if you need to see the spines or anything on these these are all various condition as you can see but if you need to see to have me take them out of the bag or anything sure uh seven dragon number eight number 55 number four Larson goodness number three uh another number three. Oh, this is savage dragon battles bedrock number three the third rock in issue and number seven get some savage dragon goodness right here one dollar winner's choice per book let me know if anybody wants to get pulls from the pull box again guys i have a one dollar pull box i have a five dollar pull box double entries on the giveaway wheel tonight for every five dollar pull If there are certain characters, what's he gonna go T there? There are certain characters. I've never read Savage Dragon, so I have no idea. Uh, any characters, titles, runs, anything like that you're looking for, just let us know. We'll do our best to uh, to accommodate. One dollar starting bid. Got about 45 seconds left if anybody wants to jump in on this. Again, every book you get gets you a spot on tonight's giveaway wheel. That one's a newsstand. Kenneth Bird in the house. Good to see you, Kenneth. Welcome, welcome. All right, there we go. There we go. Let me get the end line down. Thank you, Stream Element Spot. Yes, everyone, please hit that thumbs up for us. It helps so much. All right. I'm going to do one more. <laughs> one more. Let's do... Oh, you know what? No, I'm not because I'm not ready. Um, I want to do a virgin variant winner's choice slot, but I got to grab some books first. So let's actually get on over to Will and see what Will has got in store for us this evening. If you're ready, Will. Yep. If no, I'm good to go. Awesome, brother. All right. What do you got? Right, I'll show some buy it nows real quick, and then I'll get the off of me. All right. All right. Do some buy nows. We've got, um, man, am I choppy? It looks choppy on my end. Uh, you're lagging a little bit, but actually, it's coming in crystal clear. Yeah. Uh, we got champion, uh, champion sports one and two, uh, asking eight dollars for it. Got a few buy nows here. I'll just grab these. Got. Soulfire Dying of the Light Zero. It is a San Diego Comic Con exclusive. Ten dollars. Got a um, rugged number one. It is a Wizard World Philadelphia exclusive. Ten dollars. Got <clears throat> deceased number two by Jay Anacleto, the black and white sketch variant. Uh, Ten dollars. I've got a couple sets here. I've got Stray Dogs in Dog Days, the Trade Dress and the Virgin Variant. These are by Agnes Garbowski. 
Uh, this is for issue number one. The Virgin variant is limited to 500 and the trade is limited to 1,000. For the set, I will do $15. Nice colorful colors there, or covers there, words. And then some Predator goodness, also by Jay Anacleto. We've got Predator number one from the uh, first volume when Marvel picked up both Alien and Predator. We've got the trade dress, Virgin variant. And for the pair, I will do $20. And then I'm going to do a $2 winner's choice. All right, first up, we've got Defenders number one, Peach Momoko. We've got Avengers, uh, Tech on, <laughs> Tech on Avengers, yeah. Avengers, Tech on Avengers, the Peach Momoko cover. Then I'm not 100% sure what this cover's for, but hey, I think it's, it might be Kang number one, who knows, but another Peach Momoko. And then Giant Size Wolverine. Then Deadpool versus Old Man Logan, number one. And then Deadpool, Last Days of Magic, number one. Ex Machina, uh, Special Edition. Cool cover there. And then Joker, Daffy Duck, number one. And then Heartbreakers, number one. And then Winter Soldier, Winter Kills, number one, part of the Casualties of War. So doing all, these are $2 winner's choice. If anybody wants to get in, on, get in on these. All right, here we go. This one's live, guys. $2 winner's choice. All right, $2 winner's choice on this one. Milton Stapler sees something he likes. Milton Stapler in at two. And then this is Kang number one. I just, it's, I wrote it on the back. If I would have looked there first, you know, that would have helped, but <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then I'm working on a new game for next weekend. I don't I don't want to spoil it or anything cuz I want to make sure I get it right. But uh next Saturday should be a fun-filled uh show. Excellent. Milton Stapler in the lead at 2. We got just about a minute left on the clock. If anybody goes to 3, they can secure first picks and they set the market at 3 bucks a book. God dang it, I lost my, uh, that's my J. Damned post-its. I know, my A, my A got stuck. There we go. I like that Defenders cover, that's awesome. Mm -hmm. All right, get the, getting the end line ready for this one.
And there's the timer. Here comes the end line, making it official. Milton Stapler setting the market at $2 per book. Let us know your first claims. Alrighty. C, B, B, F and H. F, H. Got those for you, Milton. And there are some left. remaining. If anybody wants to claim these guys, get your letters in chat. First come, first serve. Only $2 per book. Doesn't look like anybody else coming in. All right. No worries. No worries. Thank you so much to Milton Stapler. Thanks, everybody, hanging out with us tonight. Appreciate you guys being here. I'm going to take a quick peek. Thanos in the lead. Yeah, I see a lot going. Thanos, obviously. Come on now. Thanos. And, and now, this is Thanos with or without the... It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It's not a fight to see who wins. <laughs> <laughs> Thanos kicking ass, though. That's awesome. Uh, all right, here we go. Let's do... kind of want to do another giveaway, but I, I got to slow down. I can't. got to slow down soon-ish. We'll do another giveaway soon-ish. Soon-ish. All right. Let me start up another round here. I've got a $7 winner's choice coming at you. Virgin Variants. Let's take a quick peek and see what we got before we start the timer. We're looking at some... Hi, X23. Goodness, this is one of David Nakayama's Hellfire Gala covers. What is it? Uh, Judgment Day, number two. Judgment Day, number two. X23 cover. We got Immortal X-Men, number one. This is the Whatnot exclusive Virgin variant. Darth Vader, number 32 in the C spot. Darth Vader, 32. Next up, we've got some Mando <laughs> and the little guy there. Mando number six. Here's some Wolverine, Sabretooth, Wolverine number 32. Another awesome Wolverine cover. Wolverine, I want it. To, it's one of the 30s. And last but not least, another Wolverine X23 cover. Wolverine, and I don't have that one numbered either. I should. Damn it. But there you go. All right, three minutes on the clock, guys. These are all an option. Of course, the pull box is still available. $5 a pull. Got a bunch of virgin variants in here, as well as trades. Every book is an exclusive. Uh, five bucks a pull. If you do get a pull, for every pull you get, you get two names on tonight's giveaway wheel. And I'm giving away all the virgin variants you see behind me. There's six of them, five of them. Five virgin variants that will be given away tonight. Get in on it. Every book you get from the winner's choice gets you a spot on the wheel. And every book uh, that you get from the pull box gets you two spots on tonight's giveaway wheel. A little extra bonus for uh, for buying from me this evening. So let me know if you guys want to get pulls from the pull box. Five bucks each. I do have a $1 pull box. You don't want it. It's dangerous. It's dangerous. $7, though, for these. We've got uh, some beautiful Virgin variants. Milton Stapler's going to get five pulls. Let me run through these quickly. I have you now. Ooh, I think I have that one up. I have you now. All right, five pulls for Milton Stapler.
Getting Milton Stapler on the wheel here. 10 entries. Perfect. 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 Let me just run through these real quick. Milton Stapler. We got a $7 winner's choice. Then we're going to get Milton's five pulls from the pull box. Get double entries for getting on that wheel. So there's Milton right there. He's got 10 spots. Going up against Comic Book G-Man for some awesome giveaways this evening. $7 winner's choice on these, though, guys. Got about 20 seconds to get in on this before they slip away. Beautiful virgin variants. I love the bad guy covers. Just awesome. All right, there's the timer. There's the timer. Let me get the end line down. Shabap. All right. Five pulls coming up for Milton Stabler. Here we go. Five pulls number one. Oh, hi. Sabine Rich does. Black Cat. Amazing Spider-Man 35. Yes, please. Next up, Catwoman. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> Got a ton of coffee. Uh, Catwoman number 58. Hi. Me wow. Oh my God. I went out the back of my house the other night and I saw the fluffiest bunny. Just this wild rabbit. He was hopping in front of me and not like like normal wild. You think of rabbits and they're screaming, right? This thing was just boo boo. <laughs> just hopping <clears throat> ever so slow. He's got uh, wet feet. I just, oh my goodness. Spring is here, by the way, in Maine. Spring is here. All right, number three. He was so cute. Hit, oh, I love this coverage. Star Wars Hidden Empire number five. Yes. The real James Willie. Happy 420, my friend. Happy 420. Lobos, Harley Quinn, black, white, and redder number five. Don't trust her. Don't trust her. And last but certainly not least, this one. A Virgin variant, I honestly have no idea. It's a Mark Brooks cover. And I don't know what it is. It's a surprise and it's a Virgin variant. Milton Stapler, thank you so much. Good luck with the giveaway. Stapler, five by five. Awesome, awesome. I'm going to do another round. I'm going to, I don't think Will's paying attention. I'm going to sneak in and do another one. <laughs> oh, what do we got? All right. Yeah, let's do these. Let's do these. I don't have the letters on them, though. The noise wrangler in the house. Steve, I owe you an apology. Uh, you donated five bucks and I never got this, um, this thing up here updated and I updated it not too long ago. So thank you so much for the $5 donation. Appreciate your support to the channel, my friend. You are awesome. Uh, it helps with all the, you know, the giveaways and stuff that we do. So right on brother. Uh, if anybody's, if anybody donates 10 bucks, at least 10 bucks to the, uh, the show, I'll do a, uh, I'll do a giveaway to the community immediately. No pressure though. No worries. Uh, let's do, you know what? And let's let's get this one going here. Let's do a one dollar winner's choice. I should put some letters on here or numbers or something, but I'm not going to. <laughs> I'm lazy. Let's just get to it here. We've got uh, one. Ooh. All is well. That is awesome to hear, my friend. All right, here we go. Uh, we've got some if you need to see grades or anything like this. These are all who knows random grades. Uh, we got Sergeant Fury, the special Marvel edition, number six. This one's got a $12 price tag on it. Son of Satan, number 20. The Devil. <laughs> death. Oh, man, this cover's got it all. Satan, the Devil, Death. I wonder if it's got a $12 price tag. All right, come on, Jim. Luke Cage, Power Man, number 22. I had this when I was a kid. This might be the copy, too. This has got a sticker on the cover. I remember this book. This... All right. Another Son of Satan, number seven. This one's got a $14 price tag on it. Pay no attention. That's that one. And that one's on the bag. Yeah. <laughs> this actually doesn't look like it's in too bad a shape. 
Son of Satan, number seven. Look at this, Son of Satan, number six. All right, I see a little, little pattern here. I'm trying to... Who's he fighting there? Oh boy, Son of Satan, 22. Ghost Rider appearance, hell yeah. And Satana. All right. Next up, we got some Marvel Presents Bloodstone. Oh, this was my favorite. I'm just kidding. I've never even heard of this. Bloodstone. Is this like fantasy or? No, this guy's got a shotgun. Pretty sure that's not fantasy. All right. <laughs> John Carter, Warlord of Mars, number three. We got some bids coming in. Milton Stapler at one, James Willie at two. Got another John Carter, Warlord of Mars, number two. And ooh, this one looks good. Colors in this one really pop. Skull, the Slayer, number eight. This god must die. All right, bear with me. I'll get some letters on here. They may not be in order, but they will have letters. Bloodstone. Anybody ever... Never mind. I've been watching old episodes of Twilight Zone the past couple of days. Man, that stuff's awesome. And I'm talking about like the 50s, you know, the originals. I happen to catch World of Worlds on TV, the 1952, I think that was. And I watched that and it's like, damn it, now I want to go back and watch the old Twilight Zone. Aha! Got the real James Willie in the lead at two. <sighs> Starscream in the house. What is up, Starscream, my friend? <laughs> Haven't seen you a bit, brother. Good to see you. Good to see you. All right, let's go back again. We've got the real James Willie in the lead at two. Son of Satan. Number seven. Power Man, 22. Son of Satan, number 20. Sergeant Fury, number six. Some more of Son of Satan, number six. Son of Satan, 22. Should probably be showing the letters, but I'll do that at the, at the end. Uh, Bloodstone, number two. Warlord of Mars. This one is in rough shape. Steven Spock, absolutely, my friend. I've heard nothing but good things about Fallout. In fact, they're coming out with a... Uh, Fallout 4 was one of the games I wanted to go back to when uh, I got my super ultra-wide monitor. But, unfortunately, it doesn't work on super ultra wide so you get these giant black bars on the side which isn't the worst thing but you know you get that monitor you want to enjoy it well turns out bethesda i think it's bethesda yeah bethesda they're going back and they're patching the game they're adding new content to follow for the game came out seven years ago or some shit and uh yeah shabap they're adding super ultra wide support so i can't wait it's uh coming out the in five days the 25th so can't wait to play it. And yes, I will be watching Fallout. Is the whole series out yet? I want to wait until... I hate getting piecemealed a TV series. I want to watch the whole damn story all at once. Let me show you the letters. Oh, real James Willie's going to take Bloodstone. I guess I don't even need to show you the letters. I put these letters on here, damn it. You're going to use them. <laughs> James Willie's getting one. Oh, James Willie. By the way, that's a spot on the wheel for you, my friend. 
two dollars and a spot on thine wheel. Shabab, thank you, my friend. Luke Cage and Nick Fury. Let me go back. Yeah. Nick Fury. Luke Cage. I remember this as a kid. Oh, man. All right. Whoops. Sorry for hitting the mic there. What do we got here? We've got Milton Stapler. Two by two. Shabap. Thank you, Milton Stapler. Two more spots on the wheel for you. Let me get you taken care of quickly. Awesome, awesome. There you go. Thank you so much. And let me go through the books one last time. I'm real monster warrior. What's up, man? I'm really surprised nobody wants these sons of Satan's. That apparently they're not bad. They got a $14 uh, comic shop uh, price tag on them here. Uh, so number seven in the D, number 20 in the B. Uh, M is number six. We've got 22L. We've got John Carter, number three in the J spot. We've got I is John Carter, number two, and Skull, the Slayer, number eight in H. If anybody wants any of those, just claim them in chat. Every book you claim is two bucks, and it gets you spots on the giveaway wheel. Looks like they're good. All right, going back in the box. Oh, I got to get those tags up there. All right, uh, let me... Shabap gonna get on over to our friend average will for his next round average will, i keep getting number. skipped you know because somebody's <laughs> being greedy and wanting to sell <laughs> no it's all right i'm like i'm trying to to uh house my uh, vietnamese food that we got for dinner so it gives me a little bit of time to eat uh Yummy. so if you just go through my buy it nows uh we've got jay Nicoletto's, uh deceased number two the black and white sketch variant ten dollars we've got uh stray dogs and dog days the number one the virgin variant or the trade dress and virgin variant fifteen dollars for those and then we've got predator number one by jay anicletto the trade dress and virgin variant twenty dollars some sweet covers here's the the art just Sick man. And then we've got some Zerdy goodness. $20 here. Can't remember the exact book this is. I didn't write it on the back, but $20 for this. Love the tattoos. Gotta love some Harley and Poison Kissy Face Time. And then here's the beautiful cover here. Catwoman 62, the Zerdy. Uh, I guess this would be the Virgin variant because the uh, Minimalist at least has a title on it. But yeah, look at those tattoos and, you know, sweet leather goodness, right? We're going to do that for 20. And I've got Moon Girl and Devil Dinosaur number one, cover A, or first printing. Going to do 20 for that. And it is a near mint, near mint minus. 25, I mean, sorry. And then uh, Miko Swan's Deadpool number five. This is from Megacon last year. $30. Got to love it with, uh, with what we could potentially get with Deadpool 3. Uh, I'm excited. Uh, can I... I'm going to do a $1 winner's, $1 winner's choice. Uh, these are going to be all westerns. Have a little bit of a western theme here on this one. Yeah! So we've got Hell Dorado number one. All-Star Western number one by DC Comics. The Good, the Bad, and the Ugly. Oh, damn. Yeah, my dad loved the movie. 
Then we got Grave Slinger. Scalped, number one. Desperado's Banner of Gold, number one. Banners of Gold, sorry. <clears throat> Desperado's uh, Quiet. Quiet of the Grave, sorry. Number one. And then we've got Desperado's Buffalo Dreams. And then Rio at Bay, number one. Some good old Western books here. <clears throat> nice. Starscream is in at $1. Thank you, sir. And then chat, let me know, would you guys be interested in the next round to either do a $8 winner's choice or do a mystery bag winner's choice? Uh, starting line would be 35. Let me know in chat if you guys are, which one you guys would be up for. And again, make sure you guys are smashing that like button and uh, sharing out the stream. We did start early tonight. I might try to keep it like this. Uh, and just have like an open format and just start it at a certain time, ended at a certain time. I'm usually just sitting around, but you know, after around seven o'clock, so. Why not just start it? Get it going. I know a lot of people may not be. No, no eight dollar mystery bag winner's choice. <laughs> Come back next week though. Next week uh, he's gonna have the game again. A new game. Yeah, I'm gonna have a new game next weekend. It's gonna be fun. And uh, yeah. <laughs> I will tease it in my stories um, on Instagram. <clears throat> Screamus tonight, a.k.a. our friend Starscream, in the lead at one. This is a winner's choice, guys. Winner's choice auction lot. 30 seconds left. The Good, the Bad, and the Ugly is fantastic. It is an incredible movie. Mm -hmm. All right, all right, all right. There we go. There's the timer. Let me get the end line down. Get your bids in now because chances are if you wait, you're too late because here comes the end line. Shabap. You got it. Art scream. That is the correct answer. You got all nine. Pump those numbers up. Those are rookie numbers. No, no, Matthew. Those are the perfect numbers. <laughs> <laughs> awesome, Starscream. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And thank you to Average Will. If anybody wants any of those buy it nows, get them in chat. Let us know. Will will take good care of you. And thank you so much for being here. Auction Comics. New starting time, guys. We're going 7 p.m. Eastern to midnight. Thank you so much for being here. Um, so, yeah, not a strict number of rounds or anything like that. Just going to go probably start closing up shop around 1145. Start doing our giveaways and shout outs and goodbyes and things like that. Uh, make sure you guys get your votes in on Thanos versus Green Goblin tonight. We're going to finish up the quarterfinals. No, no, no. This is the... I don't know. Whatever this round is. Semis? Quarters? What do they call it after the quarters? I don't know. Whatever that one is, we're going to finish those up and then get into the quarterfinals. We get the finals? It's quarters and then semis. Quarters. And then 
anyway. <laughs> it's confusing to me, chat. Somebody please explain it to me. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm kidding. All right. Uh, let's see. What else we got? What do we got? Oh, yeah. I wanted to check who's winning. Thanos is still crushing it. Decimation. Decimation. Don't forget our boy Green Goblin, though. He needs some love. He needs some love. All right, guys. We've got some giveaways tonight. You know what? Let's start up a giveaway. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, let's give away this book. No, I don't want to give away that. I don't have any of these left. All right. I see at least three of these, so I can give one of these away. We're going to give away Rogan Gambit number five. Hi. She could be coming home to you. Get it in there. What are we going to do here? Let's do... Let's see. Let's do something easy. Hashtag. Shabbat. There we go. Hashtag giveaway. Get it in there. Hashtag giveaway. That's the keyword. And should you win, you can go home with a beautiful rogue and gambit number five. Could be yours. All right, guys. Every book you purchase from me this evening gets you in on a giveaway wheel uh for five different giveaway books this evening all virgin variants all miguel mercados with the white background you got the wolvie cover captain britain gambit Chagano, rogue and back to wolvie all of these are being given away this evening five different books so five different giveaways get in there we've got a giveaway wheel going every book you get from a uh, winner's choice lot gets you a spot on tonight's giveaway wheel. And if you get a pull for my $5 pull box, it gives you two spots for every pull. Get in on the pull box. It's loaded with virgin variants, exclusives. It's awesome. It's I don't want to toot my own horn, but the pull box is pretty sweet. Um, $5 a pull and uh, two spots on the giveaway wheel for tonight. Let's go to a winner's choice lot. This one's going to be a $6 winner's choice. And here we go. Here are the options. Hi, Amazing Spider-Man 39. I've got these numbers all fucked up. Uh, in the A spot, <laughs> Amazing Spider-Man 23. Or numbers, letters in the H spot. Let me keep you on your toes here. Rico does ASM number five. What a classic. In the I spot. Speaking of classics, ASM 33, Spider-Punk, baby. That one's J. I love this cover. ASM number 36. L. Trees. James Willard. ASM number 37. Oh, wait. I've got it upside down. ASM 37. Ooh, we saw this one earlier. ASM 35. Sabine Rich, the B spot, ASM 40. Noticing a pattern here, the D spot, and last but certainly not least, number 27. I'll show the letters again at the very end in the C spot. But here we go, guys. Three minutes on the clock, six dollars. Winner's choice, these are the options. Oh, you know what we need here? There it is.
$6 winner's choice. Every book you get gets you a spot on the giveaway wheel. Get in on this. On the clock, as you can see, six dollar winner's choice, tons of options. Five dollars for each pull. Let me know if you guys want pulls from the pull box. Dirty books, so good. Five dollars a pull from the pull box. All kinds of awesome. Ooh. Hello. All kinds of awesome. Starscream, I used to work with a Mary Jane. Who smoked? Didn't know who the MJ Spider-Man character was. And she didn't know who the... Gotcha. There we go. There we go. There's the timer. Let me get the end line down. I see no bids, unfortunately. My shame knows no bounds. There you go. End line down. Let me get these letters off here. Anybody wants to get in on the pull box, please don't be afraid to ask. Five dollars a pull. We do have that giveaway. Getting, we're getting ready to do hashtag giveaway. Make sure you get in there. If you have not already, we've got six entries. Going to get a few more entries before we go ahead and spin it. So if you have not done so already, make sure you get in on that. Giving away a gorgeous Rogue and Gambit. All right, let's see here. We find something else to do. All right, let's try this one. We can try this one. Oh, uh, you know what? All right, this is what we'll do here for this one. Let's see. All right, I've got a six book lot. This one's actually not going to be a winner's choice. We're just going to do a overall bid. Whoever wins this auction lot, there are one, two, three, four, five, six books in here. So you get six spots on the wheel for this one. We're going to start it out with a $10 starting bid. And let's take a look at what we're dealing with. We've got the Star Wars. That's it. It's the Star Wars. Uh, based on the original rough draft screenplay by George Lucas. So we're talking about the original stuff here. We got number zero. Number one. Yep. Darth Vader. Uh, number two. Or oh, that may have been... No, that was Vader. That's Vader. I was going to say, is that... That may have been Java. Number three. Number four. Is he riding an ostrich? Okay. And number five. All of these books are included. $10 starting bid. Six spots on the giveaway wheel tonight. Here we go. This one's live. Milton Stapler likes it. Milton Stapler in at 10. I'm wondering if that's... Chewy? 
Or maybe that's... Hmm, I guess, I'm guessing that's Chewie. The X-Wings definitely look way different. The Falcon looks kind of the same. So if you're just joining us, welcome. Hashtag giveaway for the... Uh, we're going to be doing a giveaway shortly. And we've got a six-book lot. The Star Wars. The original Rough Draft run. George Lucas's Rough Draft run of the original. Longer ago. In a galaxy even further away. Aren't they cute? <laughs> oh, and what? Hmm. Empire Strikes. Desert Ambush. Oh, this one doesn't have a backing board. Munchkin! Oh man, I love Munchkin. That game's fun. It's brutal. Cutthroat. All right, got about a minute left. Milton Stapler in the lead at 10. If anybody would like to challenge. Right now, this is going home to Milton Stapler. The Star Wars. Zero through five. If anybody would like to get pulls from the pull box, only five bucks each, guys. Five dollars each and every pull you get. Uh, not only gives you a chance to hit an awesome virgin variant or beautiful exclusive uh, trade. They're all exclusives. But uh, anyway, you get two spots on tonight's giveaway wheel. And I'm giving away five virgin variants tonight. So five different giveaways, two spots in the wheel. One pull from the pull box could get you three virgin variants, guys. That is awesome, awesome value. Just let me know in chat if you want to get a pull from the pull box. Let me get the end line down. Looks like this is going home to our friend Milton Stapler for 10 bucks. Six spots for Milton Stapler on the wheel. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Awesome. Those are on there, Milton. Thank you so, so much. Shabap. Those are for you. Awesome. Well, I hope you enjoy them, my friend. I hope you enjoy them. Uh, let me get your name on those before I forget where they're going. All right. I think our friend Will has waited long enough. Will, do you, do you mind if I go again? Do you? Nope, looks like you're ready. No, you, you want to go again, go ahead. That's fine. Aren't you still eating? Um, yeah, it's fine, though. All right, cool, cool, cool. All right. All right, what else we got here, guys? <laughs> oh, my God. I'm not selling. Um, all right. I'm not going to bother lettering these. Let's do this. We're going to do a $5 winner's choice on this one, guys. $5 winner's choice. And again, don't forget on the pull box. Awesome books in here. We got beautiful trades, virgin variants, mostly Marvel. And every book you get gets you two spots on tonight's giveaway wheel. We do have a giveaway coming up. I'll do it after this round. Uh, so make sure you get in chat. Hashtag giveaway if you haven't already. Bronze Age Daredevil, Spidey, and Uncanny X-Men will. I don't think I have any of that, my friend. It's not this evening. But if uh, and if Will, if you got any Bronze Age, excuse me, Bronze Age Daredevil, Spidey, or Uncanny 
Starscream is looking for that stuff. Thank you for letting us know, Starscream. I love it when people ask for specific books, even if I don't have them. Thank you for letting us know what you're looking for. Darth Lucian, good to see you, man. All right. $5 winner's choice lot. All right, we've got some Atlas comics here, guys. Atlas comics. You know it. You love it. Marvel? DC? Atlas is where it's at. Atlas is the future of this industry. And here's some great Atlas books that could be yours. $5 winner's choice. We've got Scorpion number two. The Cougar. <laughs> number one. Which one's the cougar? Is it her? It's her. No, it can't be her. It's gonna be this guy. Oh wait, is it this guy? No. Tiger Man. No doubt who Tiger Man is. All right, Tiger Man number two. He stalks the night. Tales of Evil featuring the Bog Beast. Oh my God. Tales of Evil, number two. Target. Number one. Apparently this is a first. I have no idea what that says on there. First something. There you go. What else we got in here? We got some Man Stalker. John Target Man Stalker. It's a horrible costume. They're going to aim right for the bullseye. Man Stalker number three. Looks like Grim Reaper. Tarantula. <laughs> Something's first Tarantula. There we go. Tarantula number one. This guy's going to be way more popular than Spider Man. You watch. <laughs> Scorpion number three. And, ooh, some police action. Police action number three. Here we go. Last but certainly not least, some grim ghost number three. Here we go, guys. Some Atlas goodness. i telling you, don't sleep on these. This is the future. Five bucks each. Winner's choice. Pull box is still alive. Let us know if you want to get any pulls from the pull box. It's the mob. <laughs> They've boxed us in, Lieutenant. I'll keep flapping your jaw or stop flapping. That's a good idea. That's, that's why this guy's the Lieutenant. Stop flapping your jaw. Keep fighting. This time you've bought it, Lomax, we're taking you off. <laughs> Atlas Comics, baby. The Tarantula. Number one? Wow. This is all new. No reprint here, folks. <laughs> That's John Target, man, stalker. And no, no, that wasn't me. Fast action, furious target fights, the diabolical professor death. Hell bent action. And you look out for the third rail. Yep, that'll get, that'll do it. Milton Stapler sees one he likes. The word from the mob is out. Get on target. That's got to be first. Oh, I get. Yes. JT. I'm guessing this is first John Target Manstalker. Just a thought. I don't know. Don't stay playing at five. 
Bog Beast. Oh, you know what I've got? I've got some uh, graphic novels I need to price up real quick here. Got some pretty good ones, too. I think you guys might like. If you're into that kind of thing, of course. Like. The Simonson run of Fantastic Four. Look at these guns. I gotta figure out what they're worth, though. I know I prayed a little bit for them a few years ago. All right, there we go. There's the end line. There's the end line. Let me get the end line down. Chibap. All right, Milton Stapler. Let us know which ones you want. I didn't label them. I apologize. I'll go through the numbers in Scorpion 2. Cougar 1, Tarantula, all right, we got Tiger Man, Bog Beast, Target 1, Target 2, Target 3, Tarantula, The Scorpion, Police Action, and Grim Ghost. If you'd like any others, just let me know, my friend. That tarantula is going home to you. If anybody else wants to make claims, just let me know in chat. Only five bucks each, guys. Five bucks each. And they're in pretty damn good shape. Almost as if nobody ever read them. All right. <laughs> Get it? Because Atlas comment. Anyway. All right, let's see here. Giveaway time. That's what's up. Oh, shit. We just lost Monster Warrior. Monster Warrior was here and we lost him. He'll be back. He'll be back. Let's do that giveaway. Hashtag giveaway, guys. We're going to do the Rogue and Gambit. Shabap. All right. Rogue and Gambit is the giveaway book. Rogue and Gambit number five. We're going to go ahead and run it right now. Uh, here we go. The real James Willie. Just say something in chat for us, my friend. Let us know you are here. Boom. There we go. The real James Willie. Going in your box, my friend. Real James Willie. Thank you, my friend. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Shabap. And of course, we'll be having more giveaways this evening. More giveaways will be coming up. Uh, what I need to do, though, actually, let me do this. I've got to get Milton Stapler. One more spot on the wheel for purchasing that Atlas book. Shabap. Thank you, Milton Stapler. Appreciate you guys. That's right. Every book you purchase from me this evening gets you on the giveaway wheel. If you purchase two pulls from the pull box, uh, they're only five bucks each. You get two spots on the giveaway wheel. Awesome, awesome stuff there. I've taken up enough time. We're going to get on over to Average Will. Let's see what he's got for us. All right. We're going to do a... Um, we're just going to jump right into an auction. Um... Can I get a $40 starting line? Excuse me. Oh, look, DC Mike's on. What do you know? <laughs> get in here, Mike. You're more than welcome, brother. So we'll do... This is a Strange Academy. It's going to be a 14-book lot of Strange Academy. 1 through 13... Uh, number six is the A and uh, B covers. So we've got, this is the third printing of number one. And then first printing of number two. Hmm. 
And there's A, and then the B cover for number six. Awesome, awesome. All right, guys, this one's live. We've got $40 starting bid. I'm actually, actually going to step away, Will, so the show is yours. I'll be back. Oh, here we go. Good. Let's take over. All right. Uh, so here we go. Yeah, 14 books total. I guess I should probably scrounge up the other ones and just do the complete, complete run of them. But I'm too lazy right now to have to go through my other boxes. So we're just going to do 1 through 13. And again, uh, issue number 6 is the A and the B cover. Great story. If you have not read it, here's your chance to get it and read it. And hope everyone is having a good Saturday night and hope everything is going all right this weekend as we're rounding out April already. Ridiculous. got about a minute and 45 seconds left i believe i believe that's what the timer says and if there's anything specific you guys are looking for tonight um i only have a handful of rounds set up so I guess I'll have to look to see what I could bring out. Because um, right now it's only been uh, myself and Beta. And I know Monster Warrior is going to be hopping on. And if anybody else that's in our group chat wants to get on here as well, you guys are more than welcome to. <laughs> Team Canada. Nice. Speaking of country support, who's ready for the uh, the Summer Olympics this year, coming up in July? Get to watch a bunch of different sports, aside from the mainstream ones. I remember one year, my daughter and I, we were watching it, and they were doing the uh, speed walking. Uh, I did not believe that was an actual real race, but... It was. I'm not sure what how much time I have left on my timer. I think my timer is about up. All there right. Is. There's the timer. There's the timer. Let me get the end line down to make it official. What? All right. <laughs> He's Canadian. What, uh, what sport are you looking forward to the most, Will? Uh, I'm looking Event. for, I mean, soccer is one of them. Um, and then just seeing, like, the, the different stuff, like, with swimming. I love watching the, the swim meets. And then even, I mean, anything. I'm, I love, I'm, I'm a competitive guy, so I just like to see the people compete. And the excitement of when it gets down to, to the end. 
you know best in the world exactly it's always exciting when you get the the best in the world going at it yep monster warrior in the house monster warrior always a pleasure to see you my friend welcome 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 say what you guys you. How are, you doing? are you are you ready to go do you want to get started up or you want a minute to settle in or Oh, I'm good. I'm ready to go. I did it all while my computer had to restart and everything like that. So, yeah. So, I'm ready to go. So, if you guys need me to jump in, I can start. Awesome. Why don't we do that? Why don't we do that right now? All right. Everyone give a warm welcome to our friend. Uh, who is this again? All right. Monster Warrior. <laughs> all right, guys. Glad to be on. Uh, it's been a hectic couple weeks with tournaments and everything like that with my daughter. But uh, I'll go over what I have. I hope you guys saw my preview. Uh, jump in here. Look at this one. I, I got some bangers tonight. Uh, I got Uncanny Axeman, 130. First appearance of Dazzler. Damn. Detached down on the bottom staple. I think. I'll have to double check that. But a clean and impress on this. I got it at about a 4-0. Clean and press will definitely help on this, but $100 on that one. I got Wolverine, number one. First appearance of Patch. It's a very, very solid copy. I got an 8 or 8.5 or better on this one. 75 for that one. All right. I got Turtles number six. Yes. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles number six. First appearance of that guy. There's cover appearance as well. So um, $60 on that. Then I have X-Men number 100, the 100th issue for $100. I have this at at least an 8.0. Solid, solid copy on that one. $100 for that one. But like Will said, let us know if you guys are looking for something interesting or not. Um, but I'm gonna go with this one. Uh, Give me a $1 starting bid. This one is X-Men 121. It is a low, low grade. First appearance of Alpha Fight. It's still attached at the bottom staple, but barely hanging on. Like I said, if you're looking to collect them, it's a low grade. Started at $1. Your chance to have this in your collection. Oh damn! Uh, Starscream was asking about some early in, or Bronze Age uncanny. So Starscream, here you go. James Willie beats you to the punch, though. James Willie ended a buck. So, like I said, it is low grade. I got it at about a one point eight. If they're going to grade it, maybe no, yeah. I wouldn't even clean and press it, but it's your chance to own that first appearance. It's your chance to get it in the collection. So. One dollar. And again, it's not attached to the top. Still hanging on down here in the bottom. It's your chance to get this copy of this. So I'm going to throw up some Wolverines, some Star Wars, an Incredible Hulk, uh, another early X-Men. I got this is X-Men number 98. The shit's chess, it ain't checkers. Damn right. Uh, if we get action on this, I'll tell you what. Yeah, oh, if we get action I... on this, I'll throw this one in. But I gotta get I gotta get some more action than a dollar on this one, even though it's low grade. This one, this one I got at about 5-0. 
Um, could use a cleaning press. As you see, it's got that spine roll. I had a $40 buy it now on this. So if let's say if we get up to 15 on this, I'll throw that one in. And I, like I said, I have $40 buy now on that one. I had 20 on this one. All right, we're at two. Found a fitting song for today. Let's see here. <laughs> oh man, I haven't heard this song forever. Right. All right, we still got. Oh, not much time left under the clock, but multiple bidders. Star Scream in the lead at two. What is up, Peter? This was one of the first Black Sabbath songs I learned to play on the guitar. This is, I, I loved the Cochran, Cochran runs on the covers and everything like that. He did so good on them. All right, there we go. That's the timer and only one bidder remaining. Going to get the end line down to make it official. Nice grab indeed. Going to star scream. Whoops, wrong. That's not the end line. That's a starting bid. <laughs> there we go. Going to star screen for only two bucks. Nice hit, brother. Nice hit. Nice job. I'll tell you what. Star Scream, if you want it, I'll give you that one for 35 since you wanted to do it as a builder. But right now, you would take both of these for 37 bucks. Not sure if that's something you're looking for or not. But let me know. You can hit me up and hit me on uh, IG and let me know. But right now, that one's yours for two dollars. So, awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, I'll have some more later, and then also again, I don't know if you saw, I got that one up there. Like I said, I got about a four zero. I'll double check hey, it hey. again. So, oh, it's um, I wrote out here center detached at the bottom staple. So cover still attached. It's the center that's detached at the bottom staple. So still. It's just the center fold that's attached. So let me know, guys. Let me know. Let us know what you want to see. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Thank you, Monster Warrior. Can't wait to see what else you got for it. Actually, you did. You showed most everything. Right? You oh, might I have something hidden up your sleeve. Oh, yeah. Love it. Awesome, awesome. All right, let's keep it going. I'm going to do a couple rounds here, guys. Uh, so get comfy. And thank you again, everybody hanging with us tonight, chatting, bidding, lurking. We cannot do this without you guys. So thank you so much for being here. We've got some great giveaways for you tonight. For those that purchase from me, I'm giving away five different Virgin variants. Every book you get from me from a auction lot. So if there's five books in an auction lot, you get five spots on the wheel. Uh, every book you get from a winner's choice gets you a spot on the wheel and you get two spots in the wheel for every five dollar poll so let me know in chat if you want to get pulls from the poll box only five bucks each and there's virgin variants in here all kinds of sweet exclusives really really good stuff um let's do this Oh, we did the giveaway, Darth. Unfortunately, you did not win, my friend. Don't worry, there should be more. We're going to do a $6. Whoops, wrong one. Should 
Shabab. Six dollar winner's choice on this one. Let's go top down and see what we've got. We've got some more awesome exclusives here on Michael Turner, King in Black, number two. Beautiful Spider-Man in the A spot. In B, we've got DNA. Oh, hey, matey. Storm as a pirate. Hell yeah. Marauders number 14. Love that. Here's the Hellfire Gala cover of that X-23. Judgment Day number two. Beautiful Rogue Hellfire Gala in the house. X-Men 21. Beautiful. Speaking of beautiful, some awesome Scarlet Witch. Scarlet Witch Annual number one. <laughs> Look at the eyes. Mandalorian number two. Great cover. Tyler Kirkham nailed it. We got some Obi-Wan goodness. Star Wars Obi-Wan. And uh, last but not least, some more Sabine Rich. Venom goodness. Sabine Rich does Venom. Venom number nine. Here we go, guys. This one is live. Three minutes on the clock. I haven't started watching X-Men. Where is X-Men 97? Is it on Netflix or? Disney Plus. It's Disney Plus. Gotcha. Yes. That makes sense. That makes yes, sense. Yes, and I, I'm watching it. It's insane. It's insane. I saw they have Rogue with the Mohawk. Yeah, that's right. I saw like somebody posted on, oh, I can't remember where it was. I saw a picture of um, the original X-Men animated series and then the X-Men 97 characters and the subtle changes. And the biggest change I noticed was they have Rogue with the Mohawk now on the Disney Channel. Damn, I'm gonna have to get that. You mean Storm? Storm, what Rogue. I was wondering, you said it at first, I was like, wait a minute, maybe I didn't watch episode six yet, because, but yeah, no, they have Storm with the, the Mohawk, yeah. Storm. Happy 420, everyone. <laughs> Darth Lucian sees something he likes. Darth Lucian in at six. Taking the high bid. We do have polls available. If anybody wants to get polls from the poll box. Yeah, apparently that Fallout show is is so popular. Like a lot of people, Fallout's numbers on Steam and stuff, and are just going crazy. People are going back and playing Fallout. It made me, you know, check out the game again. Yeah, it was it's a video game show done right. That's what a lot of people are saying. They finally got a a good video game show. I don't know. I like the original Mario Brothers. Oh my god, that trash. <laughs> Live action. What'd you think, Peter? Did you like it? If it's anything like the game, I'm sure it's hilarious. I gotta wait until I gotta wait till the whole series is out though. I hate it is all out. Being, it is all out. Perfect. Yeah, all eight episodes are out. Yep. Awesome. There's eight episodes? Yep. And it's on Amazon. I, I see it on Amazon all the time. Yeah, Amazon Prime. Yep. And it just got renewed for season two. I guess I'm done watching Twilight Zone. <laughs> game's not bad it's not bad it's made by the same team that made skyrim uh i don't know if you ever heard of skyrim that's a pretty popular game i'd be surprised you haven't heard of that one but uh made by the same team and i like to make in those games i like to make characters that are high in charisma so they have more dialogue choices and you oh my god you can get some crazy shit to happen all right here we go um darth lucian setting the market at uh, six bucks. We've got in the A spot, the King in Black in the B spot. We've got Marauders. C is Hellfire Gala. D, we've got Rogue. E is the Scarlet Witch. 
F is the Mando. G is Star Wars Obi-Wan. And last but not least, H, Venom. Let us know which ones you want. And if anybody else wants to make backup claims, you are more than welcome to. Every claim that you get gets you a spot on tonight's giveaway wheel for those five virgin variants. Peter, Fallout 76 got horrible reviews. I never even touched Fallout 76. I barely played Fallout 4 when it came out. Yeah, Borderlands 2. Damn, that game is so fun. I love Borderlands. I'm pretty sure Borderlands was the true first looter shooter. You just get guns, guns, guns. <laughs> Good stuff. Good stuff. If anybody wants to make backup claims, let me know. We've got the A spot, King in Black, B spot, Marauders, C spot, Hellfire, Gala, D spot, the Rogue, Gala, E is Scarlet Witch, F is the Mando, G is the Obi-Wan, and H is the Venom. It does look pretty good. Yep. They got the characters looking very, very similar to the to in the game. Let us know, Darth, what you're going to pick. Let's see what I've got here. I've got some random Eternals here. Uh, I'll do this as a buy it now if anybody wants to pick these up. Let me see which issues I have. I'll do, there's six books here. I'll do it for two bucks a book, 12 bucks. Eternals number three. Awesome. Thank you, Darth. Uh, Eternals number four. Number five. These don't like to be too bad. Too bad of shape. They're not they're not hurting at all. Uh number twelve. Number eight. Ten. And back to three. Six books, twelve bucks. That gets you uh six spots in the wheel. If anybody wants to claim that, let me know. All right, Mandalorian. Scarlet Witch. Those are going to Darth Lucian. Thank you, Darth. Man, have you watched the Bray Wyatt become an immortal? I haven't seen it yet. No. Oh my God, it is so good. I really like the idea of how they're potentially going to be bringing back the Wyatt Six. Yes. Uh, rumors have it like Broken Matt Hardy is going to be part of it. Obviously, Bray's brother. Oh. oh, Dallas, right? Yeah. All right, there we go. Two spots. Anthony Kirby's in the house. Get you on there, Anthony. Thank you. Let's get you that book. Back up the Rogue Gala. Yeah. Braun, Rowan, Bo, and Alexa. Braun Strowman. Oh, what about... Oh, yeah, Rowan Harper. <laughs> uh, why am I, like, kind of behind today? Um, yeah, that's awesome. No, that's it. What about Matt, though? And isn't it six? Isn't it called the Wyatt Six? Eric Rowan, yeah, yeah. With the orange beard. They definitely need to bring him back. Holy shit. Yeah. Uh, okay. A few books left here if anybody wants to claim them. And then I finally watched that uh, The Undertaker's The Last Ride. Nice. I have seen that one. What do you think about people bitching about how, oh, it should have been Stone Cold coming out at the end of WrestleMania and not yeah. Undertaker? Just get over it. I mean, it should have. <laughs> yeah. But it was still awesome. <laughs> it was still awesome. Let me get these in the system here. One second. Um, yeah, I think Stone Cold, because they have a bigger history, you know? They yeah. have a bigger history, um, but like Undertaker's like the ghost of WrestleMania. So, yeah, that's why I I liked it. Stone Cold, he they probably would have had him do a stunner, but he's like, I can't do many more stunners anymore. Like, 
so yeah yeah that sit down position kind of like hogan with the leg drop how it like totally yeah. screwed his back up yeah i heard it was about money i heard they didn't want to pay him as much as stone cold wanted oh really you know, that's what i heard wow. stone cold like all right i'm just gonna stay home and they're like all right we'll just use taker no. that's what i heard but who knows it was awesome it was it was incredible. WrestleMania was incredible. Oh, so I meant to watch SmackDown last night. If any, somebody wants to give me a SmackDown spoiler, please, because um, I haven't looked it up. I meant to. Um, on Raw, they changed the Raw tag team titles to something new. They gave them new belts. Did they do the same thing with the SmackDown titles? On SmackDown. I didn't see it. I didn't. I haven't seen it either. Yeah, I'm not sure. All right. Um, what are we doing here? All right. I'm gonna do one more. Just a small one. Same. Yes. Yeah. Nice. 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 All right, let's do another one. Got some Superman here. Uh, let's start this at two bucks. Winner's choice. All right, here we go. We've got some, let's see here. Superman family. Which one is this here? Number 210. These books have that old comic smell. Oh, Death of Superman. Nice. Back from the Dead, The Adventures of Superman 500. Nice. Classic. Oh, here we go. Avengers versus JLA. Number three of four. Look at this cover. Thor needs a way, way bigger spot on this cover, damn it. I mean, there are a lot of characters. Holy shit. All right, that one's in there. Uh, giant JLA. Damn, this one's beat up, guys. 155. Twin moons spell doom. Are they talking about Wonder Woman's twin moons, I wonder? Let's get some JLA number 253. Batman. JLA number 185. Dark side. Nice. And Doomsday on this one. Nice. JLA 69. Classic. Death of Soups. All right, guys. Here we go. $2 winner's choice. This auction is live. Remember, every book you get from one of these winner's choice gets you a spawn on tonight's giveaway wheel. I'm doing five giveaways, all virgin variants. Take a peek at this one. Damn. Uh, did I miss Hulk? Is he not even on here? Or did he get killed by Superman in issue two? Spoiler. Oh, Lobo, nice. Or no. Right? Lo Lobo? What's this guy's name? That's Lobo. Yeah, Lobo. Lobo. I don't read much DC, but Lobo's awesome. I have, Peter. Yeah, I've been watching that stuff. Uncle Howdy. Yeah. yeah. So they keep showing, like, I've heard about people talking about Uncle Howdy and uh, the, the Wyatt Six or whatever. And they keep showing a, a shot of this guy in a gray mask. And I'm not sure if it was Bray Wyatt when he was still alive or if it was. That's Bo. That was Bo. Before, yeah. As Uncle he Howdy. Had, yes. So that. Gotcha. Gotcha. Awesome. They had Uncle Howdy and Bray uh, in the ring at the same time. At Perfect. Time. So they've so, already got the character established. Awesome. Awesome. Yes. Awesome. Yes. 
I'm glad. I hope Rod Strowman comes back. That guy's awesome. Eric Rowan, too. If that guy has kept up with, with it, I haven't seen him wrestle in years. But that guy could be a, just a monster. He was a monster back in the day. WWE just didn't use him right. They made him just look so pathetic. They have him get beaten by The Rock in six seconds. Darth Lucian at two, setting the market. Does anybody want to challenge Darth Lucian? And thanks everybody hanging with us tonight. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Nice. Yeah, that guy's just a monster. Rowan. And just both of them together. And when Harper was with them, oh man. Just great faction. That was a great faction. All right, the end line cometh. Darth Lucian in the lead at two, taking it down, setting the market. Let us know which one you want. We've got, uh, I don't have them, but all right, we'll put letters on them for you. We've got H for the Superman family, G for Adventures of Superman, A for JLA Avengers, B, don't confuse me, nope, sorry, C for Justice League, B for this Justice League with the Batman, F for the one with Dark Side, and E for the Doomsday. I assume Roman hasn't been back since WrestleMania. It might be a little while since before we see him. Our tribal chief. A, B, C, D, F. A, C, B, F. There's no D. I have no D. Ah, uh, wait. Somebody clipped that. Uh, G, E, H, E. You got it, my friend. Thank you so much. We've got uh, these two left. If anybody wants to claim them, two bucks each. Just let me know in chat. Just let me know. Anthony Kirby wants the G. If anybody wants the Superman family, only two bucks. Let me know. And every book you get gets you a spot on the giveaway wheel. If anybody wants H, just let me know. I think that's going to do it for this round. Let me get that wheel updated and we'll get on over to Average Will. And let's see what Average Will has got for us. Take it away, brother. Average Will's not ready. He's yeah, still no, I am. I am. I am. Beast. I thought you were doing the giveaway. Sorry. All right, let's do some give or not giveaways. Let's do some buy a mouse. Move some stuff around here. It's not in here. I'll find it. I'll have to find it after my round. Sorry, we have a missing uh, stuffed animal. Uh, we've got Champion Sports 1 and 2 for $8. We've got a couple Wizard exclusives we've got from Wizard World Philadelphia. Um, Shrug number one for ten dollars and then this is the from san diego comic-con uh limited to three thousand this is soul fire dying of the light so ten dollars for each or 15 for both if you're interested go janet cleto's deceased number two the black and white variant ten dollars 
Some nice trippy colors here on Stray Dogs in Dog Days number one. Uh, the trade dress is limited to a thousand. The Virgin variant is limited to five hundred by Agnes Garbowski. Uh, Fifteen for the pair. And then we've got Predator number one, the trade dress and Virgin variant. By Jay Anacleto, twenty dollars. Then some zerty, sexy goodness here with Harley Quinn and Poison Ivy. Gotta love the tattoos. And again, playing some kissy face, twenty dollars for that. And then here we go, Catwoman. All the tattoos. What'd you think of it, Peter? Did you like it? And there we go. Moon Girl, Devil Dinosaur, number one, first printing. Um, $25. It is near mint, near mint minus. Does could use a little bit of a clean, that white cover. Uh, sometimes we'll get a little bit of dirt on it. And then we've got Deadpool number four, number five. Uh, it is Miko Swan from uh Megacon 2023. Gotta love the reflection cover there. And again, who knows what, what we're gonna see in Deadpool 3. Who knows? I'm excited about it though. July is gonna be fun. All right, can I get a $5 winner's choice, please? And thank you. A little over there. All right, first up, we've got Batman 497, the second printing. Got that at a near mint. Venomize number one, the Clayton Crane variant cover. We've got Wolverine, Black, White, and Blood, the Tyler Kirkham cover. This is the Air variant. And it has, uh, like, the first page from Hulk on there. Thor number five. This is the first appearance of Black Winter. And we've got Ultimates number one. This is the first appearance of Ao, who's a member of Black Panther's Dora, Dara, Milaje. I don't think I said that right, but there we go. And then we've got God Country. Some Donny Cates goodness. This story was awesome. Uh, this is the fourth printing of it. And I'm really hoping that they actually move forward with it. I know it was optioned pre, um, pre-strike and everything like that. But so we got Action Comics. 835. This is the first comic appearance of Livewire. World's Finest 255. Then we've got Uncanny 256. Yeah, Uncanny X-Men 256. This is um, the debut of the classic Psylocke, um, costume. And then we've got Uncanny X-Men 257, uh, the first appearance of Psylocke as Lady Mandarin, and then Jubilee's yellow, uh, trench coat and shorts debuts. So Darth Lucian is in at $5. Thank you, sir. Yep, let's keep showing the books here.
And again, thank you for everyone who's hanging out with us tonight. We appreciate your time. We did start earlier tonight. And uh, we'll see if, uh, you know, this may be the new norm. So come hang out with us and get your get your early comic book fix in as we go from 7 p.m. Eastern to midnight on the East Coast. Anybody want to take it to $6? Jump on in chat. Let us know. I'll do it this way. Ooh. Man, sorry about that. The uh, Vietnamese food tonight hit the spot, making me a sleepy boy. And I have to start doing laps around the house. And if there's any of the buy it now, as you guys see, you want to throw out offers, just, you know, shoot me a DM. Got about a minute left in the clock. Darth Lucian in the lead at five. Lots of great choices here. This is a great cover here. Mr. Steel, your wife. <laughs> Good old clean cream. Ugh. I thought you were talking about Venom. He'll do that no, too. No, no, no. <laughs> Mr. Clayton Crane. All right, about 20 seconds left on this one before we... Oh, I love that cover of Thor with the glowing hammer. Damn, oh, yeah. that's a good one. Anybody want to go to six? Uh, we've got Monster Warrior on deck, getting ready for his next round. Not much time left on this one. There we go, guys. There we go. Let me get the end line down. If there are no new bids before the end line shows up, this one's going to Darth Lucian. For only five bucks. I have you now. Darth Lucian takes it away, setting the market. Let us know which books you would like. And be sure to get your backup claims in there, guys. Get your backup claims in there. You want live wire? All right. You got that, sir? And then, oh, Rafferty is back up on Kirkham. There you go, sir. You got that one, Rafferty. And I'll go through them one more time. Second print. Yes, C was Kirkham. Those were the books. Anyone else interested? 
throw it in the chat or forever hold your peace. I don't see anything coming through. No, that'll be it. All right, there we go. There we go. All right, um, let's see here. All right, we're going to get on over to Monster Warrior for the next one. Thank you, everybody, hanging out with us tonight. Oh, yeah, I wanted to check on Thanos still kicking ass in the poll. Make sure you guys vote in the poll if you haven't done so already. Thanos in the lead at 64%. Uh, let's keep it going. We're going till midnight. Monster Warrior, what do you got for us? All right, I'll go back over my buy nows again. I got uh, Uncanny X-Men 130, first appearance of Dazzler. Uh, it's the centerfold is detached at the bottom staple, but everything else is intact and solid. Uh, could use a clean and press. Definitely, definitely a benefit from it, but it's, uh, I got about a 4.0, maybe better with the clean and press. 100 on that one. I got Wolverine number one, the first of the ongoing series. Um, I got about an 8.5, could be higher. But I, I'm just being conservative right now. So I got 75 on that one. All right. Turtles number six. First appearance of Krang. First cover appearance as well. 60 on that one. And then X Men 100. For 100, this is uh, at least an 8 -0. At least an 8 -0. It's a great, great copy and in shape. I see most of these on eBay going for about 150. Right now, you can get it for 100. Right. Um, and then I'll throw this one up there really quick. I had this as a buy down. This is World's Finest, 198. Third race between Superman and the Flash. I'll do 50 on this to the end of the round. 50 on this one right here. Nice. This one's in pretty good shape, too, right? It's at least a 6 six oh six five. But there's that one right there for you. I said 50 on that one to the end of the round. All right, so let's do... Some Wolverines, why not? Uh, $30 starting bid. You get Wolverine number two. I got this at a pretty high grade. Probably can pull about a 9 0. Wolverine number three. This is probably the lowest grade of the bunch. And Wolverine number four. You get all of these right now for $30. There you go. Ten dollars a piece, and I think this one goes for at least twenty-five by itself. All right, this auction lot is live. Thirty dollars starting bid on this one, guys. Let's do this. Hope everybody's having a great evening. Thank you so much for being here, chatting, bidding, lurking. Have you seen X-Men 92 out there in chat? If so, let us know what you thought of it. 92 or 97? Isn't it 99? That's what I said, 97. What's the matter with you? You guys can't hear tonight. <laughs> oh, Peter, I did see that Prey movie. 
I was watching. I finally got the Hulu package with um, uh, Disney Plus, and that that one that was killer. Okay, so this one's the lowest grade of it, six zero with got the spine ticks, but it's all these are all complete, solid books. Frank Miller, Chris, Chris Claremont. All three of these, all three of these, Discovery. This one's the highest grade. I said it probably could fetch about a 9.0. It's got that little thing there. This one's probably about a 6.0. Got that spine work on it there. And then this one's got this. But you get all three of these right now for $30. Thank you for asking. We got Disco in. All right, got about 20 seconds left on this one. Discovery Bay Comics in the lead at 30. Not much time left. This one's going to go home to Discovery Bay unless he has a challenger. There's the timer. End line coming down to make it official. We have a winner. Congratulations, Discovery Bay, taking this one for 30. Very nice, Discovery. All right. 30 on that one. Let me know if you want to see any of the buy it now. So I wasn't sure if you were around. Hit me up. Oh, the banner's not up. Oh, my bad. Yeah, yeah. I, I, just didn't, I just thought I was that myself. Let me do this because you have your info right there. There we go. You know where to hit me up. We've done plenty of business. Story checks out right on Disco. Thank you so much. Thank you, everybody, hanging out with us tonight. We are live auction comics. Oh, what is he? What's he got there? They got this one. It's about a 4 0. It's the centerfolds attached on the bottom staple. But everything else is complete and solid. Um, we got that one for a hundred. I got the Wolverine number one. I got it at about eight five. Show that one there for seventy five. And then I was doing this one for fifty till the end of the round. So the world's finest one ninety eight third. Start of the third race. So we'll catch you around next round, though. 
I'll uh, I'll have some uh, other buy it nows as well. So thanks for uh, thanks for getting those Wolverines. Awesome, awesome. Thank you, Monster Warrior. Appreciate you. Thank you, everybody, hanging out with us tonight. I have not said it enough this evening. Thank you so much to our premium channel members. You guys rock and roll. Thank you for all your continued support. Uh, really helps us with all the giveaways and and things that we do. Uh, speaking of giveaways, we've got some really nice giveaways for this evening. We have got five different books we'll be giving away. Uh, every book you purchased from me gets you a spot on the wheel tonight. Let's see, I've got five different version variants, all by Miguel Mercado. These beautiful white backgrounds. We've got the Wolverine, Captain Britain, the Gambit, Jagannaut, and Rogue. Five different giveaways. We've got the giveaway wheel fired up, ready to go. Every book you purchase from me uh, in an auction lot. Say there's a five-book auction lot. You get five spots in the wheel. Shabap. Um, say that you get two winner's choice. There's two spots in the wheel right there. Um the pull box i have a pull box available five dollars a pull every book you get from the pull box tonight gets you two spots on the wheel yeah that's right captain america's digging it two spots on the wheel for every pull you get from the pull box five dollars a pull tons of awesome books in there yeah <laughs> i wonder if she's gonna be dazzler she's gotta be she's gotta be good to see you lizzie welcome welcome uh, but yeah, let me know if you guys want to get pulls from the pull box. And let's see. I do have a few buy it nows here. All right. We've got some trade paperbacks here. If you are interested in these, I'm a huge fan of trades, as you know. Uh, Marvel Visionaries. We've got the John Byrne Incredible Hulk run. Beautiful condition. Lightly read. Oh, love this issue. Um, 10 bucks for that one. I just priced these on eBay. These are less than, than what they've last sold for on eBay. We've got Incredible Hulk, Return of the Monster, seven bucks. Deadly Foes of Spider-Man. What a classic. Ten bucks for that one. And this one's awesome. This is the Walter Simonson one, two, and three visionaries of the Fantastic Four run. It contains... Uh, Fantastic Four 334 through 354. There's a couple issues, like apparently. He didn't write issue 351, apparently. So that one's not in there. But it's not part of continuity. These are, uh, have been lightly read, fantastic condition, and good, good stuff. I love Simonson. If you haven't figured that out, let me know if you want to get those. Uh, if you buy a trade from me, I'll give you. I'll give you three spots in the wheel if you buy any of those trades from me. Disco is going to get four pulls. Let's get eight spots on the wheel for Discovery Bay Comics. All right, let's see if we can do this without screwing it up here. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Thank you so much, Disco. Four pulls coming up for you. Four by five. Here we go. Number one. Woo. ASM 26. <laughs> Big fan of that one. Next one. Un Uncanny Avengers number one. Hi. Gorgeous rogue. Next up, uh, Strange Academy. I think it's number one. It might be number two. Part of the Virgin variant set that they did. Next up. Amazing Spider-Man, number 38. There you go, Disco. Thank you, thank you, thank you, my friend. Four books for you. Eight spots on the giveaway wheel. Good luck, brother. Good luck. All right, let's do... I haven't lettered these. Darth Lucian's going to get some pulls. Darth Lucian, all right. Three more pulls. Six spots on the wheel. One, two, three, four. All right, we'll just do it like this. Shabap. 
and ship. Why are those bold? There we go. Shabab. All right. Bam. All right. Got it. And got it. No horror, please. That I can do for you, sir. Number one. Hey, punchline number one, David Nakayama. I'm pretty sure that's a horror book. Moon Knight number 30. Awesome. Tyler Kirkham cover. And last but not least, Silk number five. The gang is all here. Darth Lucian, those are yours, my friend. Good luck with the giveaways, and thank you so much for the pulls. Enjoy. I'll get those in your box. All right. All right. I don't like comics in the house. I got a package. I got all excited. Somebody sent me comic books, and then I looked at the box before opening it and said, for I don't like comics. And I'm like, damn it. <laughs> Just kidding. Weapon X. I think it was Weapon X uh, told me. Somebody told me. And somebody told me that they were sending me your box. So I did get up excited for a moment. For just a moment. <laughs> but good to see you. I don't like comics, my friend. Punchline figure. They haven't had one yet? Damn. Oh, McFarlane hasn't had one. That makes sense. That makes sense. All right. Here we go, guys. We're going to do $2 winner's choice. You guys know how this works. You're not bidding on all the books. Just uh, setting the market for each book. And then you just select whatever books you want. So if it ends at two bucks, you get as many books as you want for two bucks. There's a ton of different stuff here. All right. In the D spot, <laughs> uh, we've got Silver Sable and the Wild Pack. I think this is... Yeah, this is bagged. It hasn't been opened, so... Uh, we've got Justice Society of America, number one. Is that Ross? That'd be right. It's gorgeous. We've got uh, Justice Society of America, number two. We've got Sword of Azrael, number six. Looks like a minimalist. Uh, Justice Society, 14, JSA. Man, I remember when the JSA omnibuses, when I was looking into getting them, they were just like so hard to find. I don't know if they've been reprinted, but they were like whales. They were really hard to find. Look at this shit. Stargirl. Uh, I love it. Reading a classic flash cost. Like, a, like, what are you doing to that book? It's a 10 center and she's got it. Ugh. All right. That's the A spot. We've got Stargirl number seven for E. Got another star girl here star girl number two of six g batman fear state alpha number one it's k and some star trek books we've got a marvel comics uh run number seven j we've got the dc run number six good god <laughs> i'm jim kirk no i'm jim kirk choose wrong and it's war. And then we've got uh, Star Trek number five, DC run, and Star Trek number seven, DC run. There we go, guys. There we go. Spinner Rick Rack in the house. Good to see you, man. Good to see you. There we go. All right. All kinds. Don't. Please never mind the alphabetical order. They're not in. I can try to get them in alphabetical order, but I'm not going to. <laughs> Two dollar winner's choice. A ton of crazy stuff in here. Good to see the spinner rack in the house. Welcome, my friend. I hope all is well. Darth Lucian seeing something he likes. Darth Lucian setting the market at two. Lizzie Venus is uh-uh. I get first pick. Lizzie Venus at three. Must be a good comic. Is that Todd Knock? It is Todd Knock. Nice. That is awesome. And soups. 
getting old. Oh, Spinner Rack Rick, you'll never guess what I finally got in the mail. I haven't read it yet. Come here. I haven't even opened it. This is not part of the auction lot. <laughs> you can tell what it is just by that. There you go. I can't wait to read this. I was reading uh, some omnibus forums and uh, somebody made a post about uh, what were they saying? Like your house is on fire and you can only grab three books. What are you grabbing? <laughs> And a few people specifically said absolute all-star Superman. I think I hear the overrated chat going for Superman. Overrated? Yeah. No, no. You deserve it is what they're chanting. <laughs> 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 have i watched i have not yet anthony kirby i have not i want to read the the absolute first but i'm probably going to do that tomorrow and then i'll watch it All right, Lizzie Venus at three. Does anybody want to go to four? And again, thanks everybody hanging out with us tonight. I'm going to take a peek and see. Oh yeah, Thanos still well in the lead. How can you not love Thanos? Green Goblin's a great villain though. There's a pay-per-view tomorrow. Oh, yeah, I'll watch that. I assume it's a bit. Yeah, it's got to be it's Sunday. Ooh. Monster Warrior weren't Siegel and Schuster from Cleveland. That is correct. Yes. So it wasn't. Um... Oh, my God. Nice, Kirby. Bye -bye. I will. I will watch it tomorrow. I promise. We will talk about it soon. All right. Let us know if you want to stay or fold Darth Lucian. Fried pie variant. Bob Kane. Bob Kane was also from Cleveland, too. Oh, uh... I'm sure we've talked about this before, Brad, but have you seen the movie Draft Day? Yeah. Kevin oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I love how it's the Cleveland Browns. <laughs> yeah. And you know what? I told everybody, I was like, right after that, watch. I hope this has the major league effect and we actually start becoming a contender. And we actually started becoming more of a contender after that movie came out. Because after me. After Major League came out, the Indians actually started doing really, really good. <laughs> I never thought about that. That's funny. <gasps> All right, I got a 30-second shot clock. Oh, there's the fold. Awesome, Darth. Thank you so much. All right. Darth has his backup claims, but it is Lizzie Venus, who has set the market at $3 per book. She gets first pick. And don't forget, every book you choose gets you a spot on that giveaway wheel. I'll go through them again. Just let me know which letters. If you need to see anything up close or anything, just let me know. Oh, that's e that's even easier. All three Star Girls and Batman K. Awesome. Star Girl, Star Girl, oh, and Batman K. Shabab. All right. Ooh, AEW pay per view tomorrow. Nice. I know there's a lot of drama about about AEW right now, but I'm actually kind of I'm getting into it, so I, I kind of want to see if they can bounce back. I'm kind of rooting for them. Wrestling's hot right now; it's getting really popular, so it's it's only a good thing if if you know if, if they put on an awesome show. 
uh, what do we do? Three, three bucks. And four spots for our friend Lizzie Venus. Let me get you on the wheel here. Whoops. I agree, Anthony Kirby. I agree. It was really, really cool to see that. So. Oh, and then uh, Justice Society 1 and 2 for our friend Darth Lucian. Two more spots for Darth Lucian. Two, five, three. Get Darth Lucian on here. Perfect. All right. Dynasty. I see. That was kind of cool. I I kind of ruined it though. I mean, apparently it's really nothing like that in real life. Apparently it's all Hollywood, but it, I love it. Don't tell me that. I don't want to hear that again. <laughs> that movie was great. I've seen it multiple times. All right, there we go. We are good. Let me go through these books one last time. I can tell Will's got something special. Will is ready to go. Will is ready to go, but. $3 if anybody wants these. We've got D, Silver silver Sable, some sort of fried pie bagged in the bag. We've got some uh, sort of Asriel Star Trek. Anybody wants to get in on the Star Trek? Only three bucks a book. <laughs> Front house. And a JSA number 14. If anybody wants to get in on those, just let me know. Three bucks a book in every book you get. Get you a spot on that giveaway wheel. Thank you so, so much for hanging with us, guys. We are going to keep it moving. We are headed back to not so average, Will, for the next round. All right. Uh, it looks like Anthony Kirby threw in a couple uh, claims there. Anthony Kirby, I got you C and D in the house for Anthony. Oh, we got that bagged fried pie. Very nice. All right. You got those, Anthony Kirby. Two spots in the wheel for you, brother. Thank you. Alrighty, so let's get into some buy it nows. We've got um, spawn number nine. First Angela. CD's nuts. Yeah, I'm a child. Can't help it. Uh, Fifteen dollars does need to have be cleaned a little bit because it's got just a little bit of dirt or dirt smudge along there. But near mint, a near mint minus. Definitely give a clean. $15 for that. We got the West Coast Avengers 1 through 4. Of the uh, the four-part miniseries. Right? Yeah. You know, four-issue limited series. Uh, Fifteen dollars for that. Moon Girl, Devil Dinosaur, number one, uh, first print, twenty-five dollars. Then Iron Man at two eighty-two. I got this at a fine minus to fine. Uh, $25 bin on that. And then Web of Spider-Man number one. I got this in a near mint. The near mint minus. $25. Yeah, the, the cartoon um, on Disney is great. My son loves it. Uh, it's, it's really good, well put together uh, cartoon show. But it'd be cool to see it done in live action. Then I've got Predator, Alien vs. Predator, 1 through 4. A face only a mother would love. $25 for that four book set. And then... We got this about a 6 0 
It is Marvel Spotlight 28. Damn. $45 bid. And, um, let's see here. Give me a $20 starting line, please. And this is going to be a nine book lot here. Not the complete, you know, obviously not the complete run, but it is mo moving, missing, missing some, a few issues. But we got the Jeff Lemire run of Thanos. And then what Donnie Cates took over, I think, on issue, issue 13. So I got issue one, two, three. Four, five, and then no six, but it jumps to seven, and then number eight, no nine, goes to ten, no eleven, jumps to twelve. So nine books in the uh, Jeff Lemire run, started this run, and then again, Donnie Cates took over at issue uh, 13. All right, here we go. Clock has begun. $20 starting bid on this awesome Thanos slot. Yes, Rita's is the smartest man alive. That doesn't mean he's the smartest person alive. And isn't uh, Franklin smarter? Yeah. Supposedly, right? I was reading about how Spider-Man has the worst case of plot armor uh, among any superhero because, like, <laughs> he gets hit by something, like, crazy and it, it almost kills him or he gets hit by, like, a bank robber and it almost kills, you know, all these different things just always barely kill him. It's always just plot armor that just saves him barely. But he is awesome. And Franklin isn't stretchy. Makes the worst decisions out of most all the heroes. I'm guessing you're talking about Spider-Man and not Franklin. <laughs> no, I think he's talking about Reed. Oh, oh. That is correct. Absolutely right. He was talking about Reed. Yep. I would agree. You're telling me throwing, you know, Hulk out, out into space onto his own planet was a bad idea? Yeah, you just pissed him off even more. <laughs> Couple minutes left on this one, guys. Don't sleep, Thanos. Twenty dollars starting bid. Got a little time for you to check this one out. Check out your pricing. It's a good value on this one. Twenty dollars starting bid for all these books. Mm -hmm. And then we're doing a show May fourth, correct? I would assume so. That's Saturday. Yeah. Well, yeah. Don't, I don't want to. I don't want to assume. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Because I've got a, I've already been putting together. Oh yeah, we got to go Star Wars heavy that day. Oh uh, yeah, I've already been putting together nothing but. So, and then that's free comic book day as well, which is nice. Right on, James Willie, fifteen months sub. What a legend! Happy four twenty to you, my friend. And it's free comic book day on, uh, yes, May the fourth. Yep, yep. Less than a minute to go on this one. The clock is ticking down. $20 gets you all these books.
check your IG average, Will. I'm sure he will. Absolutely. I will once my round's over. I heard my phone going off. <laughs> Petty Ray Jim. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's get that end line down. Doesn't look like there was any love, but if you are watching on the replay, don't be afraid to do what Darth Lucian did and reach out to Average Will on Instagram. And uh, maybe these books will still be available. So, yeah, there we go. There we go. Awesome, awesome. All right, thank you so much. Thank you so much, Average Will. Thank you, everybody, hanging with us tonight. Appreciate you guys being here. We cannot do this without you. And happy 420. We've got a little, got a little music here going for you. Let's get over to Monster Warrior and uh, see what he's got going on for us tonight. All right, I'll show these buy downs once more, and then I'll probably change them out for the last couple of rounds. X Men 130 centerfold is detached on the bottom staple. It's about a 4 0. Definitely can get better with the clean and pressed. Uh, $100. Again, offers are always accepted, especially if you bundle. Wolverine number one. Probably this is at least an 8.5 or better. Uh, 75 bucks for that one. Turtles number six. First appearance of Craig. $60 on that one. I have X Men 100. I got it at about an 8 0. Could be better. 100 for 100. There you go. That's a good band name. Oh, man. Yep. That one got me laughing. World's Finest, 198. Third, Flash, and Superman Race. 60 on that or best offer. So I'll show a couple other ones and we'll get into an auction. Uh, I have X-Men 134 and 135. High mid grades. I got this one. I got 134 at a 6.5. Could be better. And then the 135 I have at a 4.5 range. You can get both of them for 75 bucks. Both of these right now for 75. Right. Uh, give me a $10 starting bid, Beta. I'm going to go with Star Wars number five and number six. You get both of these books. Start at $10 right now. Number five. I want to say this is like the appearance of Chewbacca in the comics. But I might be wrong. And then you get number six, which is actually a Whitman variant. Both of these right now in for ten dollars.
There we go. You started it. You started it, Anthony. <laughs> so loud. I'm listening to the replay in the kitchen. You can hear me. Speed up. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Thank you, everybody, hanging with us tonight. Saturday night auction comics. Getting around the 10 p.m. mark here on the East Coast. Going to go for a couple more hours. Stick around. We got more giveaways coming up. I'll do at least one more. At least. Still just with these two. There's the timer. There's the timer. Milton Stapler, the only better. Gonna have to put the end line down if there are no new bids before the end line shows up. This one goes to Milton Stapler. Ten bucks. There it is. Great grab. Great grab. Let me know if anybody wants any of those buy it nows. Like I said, willing to take offers. Awesome, awesome, awesome. If you, and of course, if, as always, if you have any questions about any of the products that you see, please ask. We're more than happy to uh, answer any questions yeah. you may have. Well, you're going to hear electric music, solid walls of sound. <laughs> All right. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. Somebody mentioned a giveaway. Let's do a giveaway. Let's give away Mr. Obi-Wan Kenobi. Shabap. Star Wars Obi-Wan number one, David Nakayama. This is a giveaway. For those of you that don't know, it doesn't include shipping, but it will go in your box for free. We'll get a box started for you. Let's see. Hashtag. Whoa, that's not a hashtag. <laughs> oh. No, I was going to try to be cute, but it's not going to work. Let's just do hashtag beta ray. Nice and easy. Let me. This one right here, share. There we go. Hashtag Beta Ray. Get it in there. That's the giveaway for this Obi Wan Kenobi. We'll give it away if we get a few entries. We'll wait till we get a few entries, but get it in there. Hashtag Beta Ray. 
And yeah, thank you everybody hanging out with us tonight. Oh, okay, now a jarhead. Good to see you, man. Awesome, awesome. Hashtag beta ray. Get it in there. Get it in there. I do have some buy it nows available. If you guys are so interested, let me know. Uh what do we got here? Doomsday. You guys ever hear of this? Doomsday from Charlton Comics. Let me change the all right, uh, Doomsday, all new Doomsday, Charleston Comics, 25 centers. We got number one, uh, excuse me, Doomsday plus one, I guess. Uh, number five, number three, number two, number four. I've got them all in order for you. Uh, and I've got two copies of number five, apparently. Um, let's do these for 10 bucks. 10 bucks by it now. I know they all got $10 and eight dollar price tags on them but and they're in pretty good shape but i've never heard of it so uh 10 bucks gets you these doomsdays uh there's five books five spots in the wheels first come first serve i've also got 15 cent dell comics maverick these aren't in horrible shape for being 15 centers these are uh kind of niche though um we've got maverick Did I, I didn't even look at the numbers here I, it's probably under that price tag. No, they just went by months. That's right. We've got September. Jack Kelly, Roger Moore. Have gun will travel. Oh, they, they do have numbers. That's number four, apparently. Uh, wagon train. Number. Damn, 971. Holy shit. How many episodes of wagon train are there? Or come, Jesus. <laughs> I'm new to these. If you had uh, Dell Comics Colt 45, <laughs> number four, 10 bucks. Or I'm sorry, not 10 bucks. Uh, 30 bucks gets you all four of them. 30 bucks, buy it now. Get you all four, including some awesome mustaches. I mean, there's some pretty good mustaches here. Except on that one. I lied. And that's the most expensive one. That's ridiculous. Let me know if you want and two zigzags there you go let me know if you want to get in on those let's do another um oh, just notice that that's one of those uh can't remember what they called those let's see here winner's choice yeah two bucks sounds good two dollar winner's choice let's do it again you guys know how it works. You're not bidding on every book, uh, just bidding on the books that you like, starting at two bucks. The first one to get in there sets the market at $2 a book, and you can pick the books that you want. Before we start, though, uh, just remember about the giveaway, hashtag beta ray for the giveaway coming up. And I've got a giveaway wheel going for every book you purchase from me. That will get you a spot on tonight's giveaway wheel. I've got five version variants that I'm giving away tonight. So five different chances to win. Uh, you just got to get in there. The best way to get on the giveaway wheel is to get a pull from the pull box. I've got a $5 pull box. Every book in here is an exclusive. I've got versions and trades. $5 a pull not only gets you an awesome book, it also gets you two spots on the wheel. That's right, two spots on the wheel for every $5 pull that you get. There's some awesome, awesome books in here. It's got to be in it to win it. Five bucks to pull. All right, let's get back to the $2 winner's choice. We've got some uh, some JLA, JLA 75. Justice League of America, number one from the 06, I can't even see, 06 series. All right, not bad, not a bad lineup. Uh, same series, number two. Number four. Uh, here's Justice League Quarterly, number three. I'm guessing this is not from the 2006 run. Uh, here's one from the 25 centers. It's got somebody's initials on it. Some old Batman Superman. JLA number 117. Got some silver, sable goodness. Marvel Comics. Silver Sable in the Wild Pack. That's got 90s all over it. Uh, we've got some Army of War, Sergeant Rock, number one. Got 
Another Army of War, Sergeant Rock. This one is uh, number 290. Uh, sorry, number one. Did I say number one for that one? It's This is number 290 and number two, <laughs> 291. Nice, Peter. I wonder how she feels about that whole lawsuit thing. I'm sure she's not happy. Miracle Man from Eclipse Comics. That's right. Everybody's favorite Eclipse Comics. There we go, guys. This auction lot is live. That's fine. And again, let me know if you guys want to get pulls from the pull box. Only five bucks each, and every pull gets you two spots on the wheel. <laughs> hmm. Other than Flash, I'm having a hard time naming anyone on this cover. Oh, Green Lantern. That's got to be a Green Lantern there, right? Obviously. Yeah, that's about it. $2 winner's choice. Is that a Turner cover? Nice. I wonder these are so awesome. I could put the sticker right over Superman's head. Nice. Some cool Turner art here. dollar starting bid let me know if you guys want to get in on this get five dollar pulls in the pull box let me know if you want to get in on that five dollar pulls $2 winner's choice. Got about a minute left in the clock. If anybody wants to start us off, let me know if you guys want to get any pulls from the pull box. Plenty of good stuff left. Get yourself on the giveaway wheel. Don't forget about the hashtag we got in chat. Hashtag beta ray. Get it in there. Less than a minute on the clock. $2 gets your first pick right now. These Michael Turner covers are awesome. Got about 20 seconds left. Let me get the end line ready. Wow, nobody wants the Sergeant Rocks. Jonathan Dodson would like a pull. Nobody wants the Eclipse. These are, this is the future comics. <laughs> All right, end line coming down. No worries, no worries. Uh, let's see here. All right. Jonathan Dotson wants a couple spots in the wheel. He's going to get Dark Knight's Death Metal number seven. Damn, that's a nice cover. The Bat Scythe.
Awesome, Jonathan. Thank you so much. Let me get you on the wheel. Give me just one second. There you go, brother. Oh, two spots in the wheel. Excuse me. Thank you for purchasing from the pull box. Two spots on the wheel and good luck to you. Hopefully we can get you a free book. And don't forget about the giveaway, guys. We're not going to do it right now, but we will be doing it soon. Get it in there. Hashtag Beta Ray. We're going to get over to Average Will. See what he's got for us. Take it away, Will. <laughs> clicky, clicky. Um, all right, this is going to be my last round. Um, I'm not going to be able to make it to midnight. No worries, brother. No worries. Yet. But um, hopefully this will be a fun one. I've got a... Uh, a large stack of spider mains that we could do but um all right let's go through the buy it nows again real quick we've got spawn nine first angela got this as near mint minus uh 15. West Coast Avengers, the four part mini series for 15, all four books. And then have a good night, Peter. Thank you for hanging out with us. Uh, Moon Knight and Devil Dinosaur number one, uh, first print, $25. Have a good night, Peter. Take care, Lizzie. See you guys. Iron Man 282. Got this about a five minus for 25. What was Spider Man number one? Uh, near mint. $25. Alien vs. Predator 1 through 4 for 25. <laughs> I like that, Milton. And then Marvel Spotlight 28. Uh, Moon Knight's first solo series, $45. I got this about a 6 0. And I'm going to do a builder and when I say builder it's going to be I'm going to start this off and then every two dollars yeah I was going to do three but we'll you know screw it we'll do every two dollars after the first bid we'll bring in another book and I got a huge stack here so can I get a ten dollar starting bid please sir Got a couple low grades of Marvel Tales. We got Marvel Tales uh, number 13. Um, the front cover is detached. And then we've got Marvel Tales number 15. Start this off at 10. And then every $2, we'll bring in another book. And, you know, this would be the next one to come in. ASM uh, 82, and then it builds up from there with uh, ascending order. Not not in not in exact order, but it helps if I have my mic over here too. So, Thank you, Milton. Not necessarily. I mean, I just was figuring every two dollars I'd throw in another book. Because again, I have. Uh, Oh, I got this massive stack. So you want 
And I'm gonna have to, all right, so we've, we got these in at uh, 10. So you want 20 more books added, right? Thir 15 more books added? Math, my brain's hurting already, right? <laughs> yes, you start mathing. So that's 30 additional dollars. So yeah, that'll be 15 books. So we got Amazing Spider-Man 82. And then Amazing Spider-Man 217. Man, that, that light is not one to help that. Uh, then Amazing Spider-Man 230. Two thirty-three, two forty-three, 243. Then it goes up to 364. Ooh, focus. There we go. Yeah, so 364. 364. Oh, I was out of order here. So 281. <laughs> right? Yeah, it was out of order. So 281. Love the floating heads. And then 284. Two eighty five. Let's see how many is, is that? Just so I can start pulling off the other ones. That's nine, so I owe you six more. Five, six, here we go. We've got 287. Three fifty-five. Three fifty seven, three eighty three, three eighty four, and we go up to five forty four, which is one more day part one. So that is what you have there at forty dollars, sir. Nice big old stack of uh, 17 books. All right, let's not drop the books. So that's another five books. So one, two, three, four, a five. All right, so here we go. We've got the Sensational Spider-Man 41, which is One More Day Part 3. We've got the Amazing Spider-Man 563. Look at that, he's on a little go-kart. Or uh, bumper cars, sorry. And then Amazing Spider-Man 558. 626. And then 627. So that's what you got right now for 50. We are at 22 books. And again, we have more that can come in. The, the numbers just keep going up, obviously. Um, ascending, but there are complete parts like, uh, you know, the shed thing, you know, shed with mist with the lizard. That's like what a four part series and then grim hunt four part series. And then the one moment in time. Still got a nice little stack here. 
if anybody else wants to jump in, Milton has already started off a nice little pile here at $50. And he says, let's go, let's go, uh, let's go five more books. So actually I'm going to give you six because we're going to give you, um, Amazing Spider-Man 628. 629. And then we're going to keep the run going because this is the shed little arc we've got. 630, which is Shed Part 1. 631, Shed Part 2. Part 3. That's a gnarly one. I like that cover there. And then the final part, Part 4. I appreciate you, Milton, for making that. Oh, Spinarak says, okay, let's uh let's do three. Let's do three more. So actually, I'm just gonna yeah, we'll do yep, because actually that works out perfectly. Because then we got 634, which is the Grim Hunt part one. Uh 635, which is part two of the Grim Hunt. And the Grim Hunt Part 3, 637, or 636. Yeah, 35 and 36. Millen says two more, please. Well, okay, you've got one moment in time, which is Spider-Man 638. And then 639. Look at that. Spider Man in his uh, black suit. Spinarak goes 76. All right. So now we're about to cross over. We're going to, we're going to have a, uh, Oh no, we won't. We have not hit 800 yet, so Spinarak is going to add in 699.1. Enter Morbius. And then here we go. We've got some Venom Ink Part Two goodness. This is 792 of Amazing Spider-Man. And then here we go. 799. Don't know how much time is left on the clock. Ah, uh, Milton is gonna. Oh, fold. the clock! Yep, clock just went off. There we go. We're gonna put the <laughs> end line down to make it official. <laughs> Our winner, Spinner Rick Rack. Nice. <laughs> or, yeah, you know who I. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Spinner Rick Rack. Rack Rick Spinner. Congratulations. <laughs> awesome work. Nice and nice long Matt. bill. Massive, massive brick of Spider-Man parts. Pallet shipping coming your way. <laughs> All right. Awesome. Well, was that your last round? Is that it? Yeah, that's, that's going to be my last round. Well, I certainly appreciate you being here, as always, my friend. No, I'm glad you had fun with that, Milton. Yeah, I mean, I had this. I was going to do this last week with the... Uh, just been sitting here accumulating... A bunch of different spider-man books and i'm not collecting as much as i should but yeah awesome i'm glad i can uh get those books over to you guys awesome awesome can't wait to see what you got for us next week looking forward to that game yeah, definitely it's gonna, it's gonna be fun it's 
going to be a good one. Awesome, brother. Thank you. Thank you. All right. There we go. Just like that. Average will. We are going to keep it going, though. We are going up to Monster Warrior. Let's see what he's got for us. Monster Warrior. It's all yours, brother. Take it away. All right. So, nothing different by now for you guys. Nobody was wanting the other ones. So, you got 134 and 135 of the X-Men. Both of them high make grades. 75 for the both of them. 75 for the both of them. All right. Didn't hear from Sarscream, so I was going to throw this one up there. For 40 bucks. This is X-Men 98. X-Men 98. Cool cover of the Battle and the Sentinels. Got Swamp Thing, number seven. First time meeting Batman. Got that one for $30. Nice. And then again, I went with these two just to kind of round it out. World's Finest, 198, third race. And then X-Men 100. Oh, I probably got about enough for two more rounds, so I'll do. Um, you guys want Hulk or five Batman books? Oh man! So you guys, let me know. Hulk or five Batman books? Well, damn! Five so one hundred two. 104, you were close. 104. Oh, I was like, you don't know that one? <laughs> I shouldn't I shouldn't give you shit. I didn't know it. I'd say about 5560. 5560 is the grade on that. That's the one I would put up first. Let's put that one up. Just got some kicks there, but I mean, other than that, maybe a little, a little bit of chip in there, but it's solid, it's intact. So, we got some interest in that one. I'll start this one off. Uh, uh, starting bid would be $20 on this one. All right. I think we have a winner. Let's do it. Oh. Starting. Well, he says, hold on. He said Batman. Oh. He's looking oh. for an upgrade on the one he has. Okay. He's the only one saying it, so I'll go with Batman. <laughs> I will do starting bid of 15 on the Batman's then. All five are in. All five are in right now. So $3 a book. You get Batman at uh, 311 Great band, by the way. Detective Comics, 522. Batman, 362. I've always loved this cover. With the red letter. Who says crime doesn't pay? I do. Then you get uh, no, Batman, 356. This is the first modern day appearance of Hugo Strange. And then an awesome Joker cover. So this is Batman 353. All five of these are in. Clock has begun, and so is Milton Stapler in at 15, starting us off. Just stand there. I'm going to appear out of nowhere and throw these bad guys at you.
Some awesome Batman here. Milton Stapler in at $15. $16 gets you the high bid. Oh. It's a refresh. That won't go up next round. You're a little behind, Steven Spock. I'm Batman. Milton Stapler in at $15, $16 gets you these books. All of these books are in. Still got plenty of time on the clock. All right. What are the uh, issue numbers again? We have 362, 356, this is 353, 311, and then this Detective Comics 522. It's pretty solid. Uh, it's got the spine roll on it, as you can tell. But if you got that clean and press, I would say it's at least a solid, solid seven, seven, five. You know, I'll do a spine slide. Like I said, clean and press, they'll, they'll get that spine roll out for you. It's nothing really color breaking. Except for right about there. But even then, the clean and press on that probably would get that all straightened out and everything. Let me know. If you want to make a deal on or something. All right, there's the timer. There's the timer. Let me get the end line down to make it official. Ernie Wrightson cover. Right. Yeah, correct. All right, there we go. The Batman. Batmans are going to Milton Stapler. Tell you what, you got these for 40, or you got these for 15. All right. There we go. Look at that. So 45 total for... We, what were you going to say, Monster Warrior? What were we going to say? <laughs> no, I, you know what? no, he's good. Because you know what? I'm going to get... He's bought so many off of me. This is what I'm going to do for you, Milton. I'm still going to give it to you. We got him, Milton. We got him. Yeah. All five of those all five of those Batman books and this one I'm giving to you for 40 bucks. On top of the ones that you already bought tonight, too. So... Right now you're in for like 50, but uh, yeah. So I'll give you a deal. You've gotten a lot off of me. Giving you a deal on that one. So five Batman books and the Swamp Thing. You got it for 40 bucks. Nice. Awesome, Milton. Congratulations. On that one. So not a problem, man. Sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. And you guys just got to ask about them. That's ask right. Them. That's right. 
That right. is right. Awesome, Monster Warrior. Appreciate you, brother. Appreciate you. We're going to keep it going. I'm going to do a couple rounds myself here. Thank you, everybody, hanging out with us tonight, chatting, bidding, lurking. Uh, at some point during my round, I'm going to do the giveaway, so make sure you get in on this hashtag. Beta Ray is the keyword, and the giveaway will be Shabap, Star Wars, Obi-Wan, David Nakayama, number one. It's going to somebody in chat. You got to be in it to win it. Just hashtag Beta Ray. That is the keyword. All right. Let me do some buy it now. So what do we got here? What do we have here? All right. Trial of Magneto. Three book buy it now. Trial of Magneto. One, two, and three. Uh, 15 bucks. Get you all three and three spots on tonight's giveaway wheel. 30 bucks. Get you five books. X23 Deadly Regenesis. One through five. 30 bucks. Get you all of them. All the exclusives. It's my last set. Damn, they are awesome. 30 bucks gets you that X23 bundle. 25 will get you the Silk bundle. Silk 1 through 5, all the exclusives. Number 4 and number 5. 25 bucks, 5 spots in the wheel, and all 5 Silk exclusives. 30 bucks will get you all 5 Venom Lethal Protectors. All Tyler Kirkham exclusives. 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Just claim them in chat. First come, first serve. Let's do a winner's choice slot. Uh, let's do six. Six is good. Six dollar winner's choice. Got a few selections here for you. For your consideration. Uh, and remember, every book that you get gets you on tonight's giveaway wheel. I've got five different virgin variants I'm giving away tonight. Five different giveaways. Every book that you purchase from me gets you a spot on the wheel. You guys know about the pull box, $5 pulls, $5 pulls in the pull box. Just let me know if you want to get any pulls from the pull box. We've got some Scarlet Witch goodness in the A spot, David Nakayama, Harley Quinn, black, white, and redder, number one, minimalist, nice, Batman TMNT, number one, nice, get some Harley Quinn goodness, Harley Quinn, number 33. Star Wars Mandalorian, number four. Beautiful Zerdy Rogue, Fall of the House of X. Original X-Men, number one. And <laughs> Tyler Kirkham's Wolverine, number 16. Let's put five minutes on the clock for this one. Looks like we got a friend that just jo dropped in. Oh, look, he might be lagging here. Let's see. So twice. What's up, brother? Good to see you, man. Me? Yep. We can hear you. So, guys. Good to see you, man. Good to see you. <laughs> welcome, welcome. I'm walking my dog. Oh, Let me get back. I was like, <laughs> oh, you must have heard me. Hey, <laughs> chill. Oh. And we lost him. And just like that, he was gone. All right, guys. $6 winner's choice. Every book you get from this gets you a chance to win one of the free giveaways at the end of the night. Patrick Kelly in the house. Good to see you, Patrick. We have lost Soul Twice. Soul Twice was here. Good to see Spike's doing well. Patrick. Patrick, 10 bucks. I've got five bucks. 10 bucks. We've got 
Justice League of America 117. It's pretty beat up. Justice League Quarterly number three. Not in great shape. Justice League of America number four. Not bad. Good shape. Number two. Number one. 10 bucks gets you all five books and five spots on the wheel. All right, Patrick's got it. Let me see if there's anything else we may have that Patrick may be interested in. Probably not. Ooh, in case anybody missed this one. I'll do this one for 12. Uh, I've got six books, uh, six Wolverine books. You sure do, PSK. Absolutely. 12 bucks gets you six Wolverine books. I want to say, like, yeah. Anybody wants these? Let me know. Any Wolvie fans out there? And I've got a bunch of Atlas. <laughs> you name it, I, I do the whole livery. Ox and cattle, bison, you you name it. I'll take I'll I'll hold it for you. We got a huge livery, huge barn. Six dollar winner's choice on this one. Six bucks gets you any of the books that you see here. And a spot on the giveaway wheel. Oh, speaking of giveaway, hashtag beta ray. Make sure you guys get it in chat. I'm going to do this relatively soon. Hashtag beta ray. Anthony Kirby sees something that he likes. Thank you, Anthony. Beth is in the house. Good to see Beth. Uh, let's see. Oh, oh. Uh, buy it now. Six bucks. Three Superman books. Superman Family, number 202. Superman Action Comics, number 12. Superman Family, number 201. Six bucks gets you three books by now. Patrick's gonna take it. PSK, six. Three more spots on the wheel. For PSK. All right, we've got about 15 seconds left. L. Dot Green with an E machine in the house. Good to see you. L. Green Machine. I don't know if he can hear us, but he's in the chat or he's in the show. Awesome, awesome. All right, there's the timer. Let me get the end line down to make it official. End line. Shabap. There we go. There we go. All right. Anthony Kirby, you have set the market. Just let us know what letter or letters you would like. And if anybody would like to make a backup claim, just let us know with those letters. What is up, Larry? Good to see you, man. Oh, and he's gone. I'm guessing he couldn't hear us. A, B, D, and H. Gotta love that one. Awesome. Oh, I think Larry's back. All right, that's four. Four times six. Those are for you, Anthony Kirby. That's going to be four more spots on the wheel for you, my friend. All right. If anybody wants to claim any of these books, they 
are still here. Let me just try to get more. All right. Can he hear us? Can you hear us, Larry? Yeah, I can hear you. Just give me a second. I'm writing stuff down for... Oh, my, uh, give me a minute or two, would you? Good <laughs> awesome. I'm, send, good I'm sending you, you. you information. Sending you some information on the chat. For the, for the scroll thing at the bottom. Awesome, awesome. Perfect. All right. Uh, so if anybody wants to claim any of these, six bucks each, we've got G, we've got F, we've got E, and we've got C. If anybody wants to claim those... Those are available. All right. Let's see here. Let's run that giveaway. Trying to find any more other like Superman related books. Um, I don't know if you want this one, PSK two bucks, Justice League of America, number 75. It's got that logo there, so I don't know if that means like it's a limited print. No, no, that's the DC Universe logo, so I'm not sure if that's related or anything like that. If you want that, two bucks. Another spot on the wheel. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay. I'm just going to do this. Pass on that one. No worries, brother. Let's do this. Uh, since we're still waiting for Larry to get his stuff set up, looks like we lost him. Uh, but once he comes back, we'll do. We'll get him back in here. I'm going to do another winner's choice. Oh, no, I'm going to do the giveaway. Shit. Here we go. Hashtag beta ray. That's the giveaway. 14 people in. Thank you so much, everybody. They took a moment to uh, enter into the giveaway. Good luck to each and every one of you. Let's run it. Here we go. Who's going to get it? Who's going to get it? Obi-Wan going to Jetto. Jetology is a premium channel member, so he's here. Awesome. And I just shipped your books to you. Holy cow. That's all right. We'll start your new box. Awesome, Jetto. Congratulations. Um, let's see. I've got to get this updated, but I do want to present this one, Shabap. I've got to get a few names on it. Everybody that's purchased from me this round is still... <laughs> exactly, exactly. Awesome. Thank you, Jetto, and congratulations. All right, let's get back to this one. All right, we've got about another hour left or so. We're going to, we're going to keep going here, so let me do... Oh. Now I'm having problems with off uh, with the internet. No worries, Larry. No worries. I know it can be, especially when it's showtime. Like I started having problems with my camera, like right when I went to start at 6 p.m. tonight and I could not get it or 7 p.m. What time did we start? What day is this? Um, <laughs> could not get it to work. Could not get it to work, but we're here for you, brother. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. So yes. Um, uh, Got to get some names updated. I've had so much coffee tonight. I think I'm going to be reading that All-Star Superman tonight. <laughs> I'm going to probably read the whole thing tonight and watch the show. Let's do a winner's choice. <laughs> the two-year icon. I really need to get a two-year icon. Absolutely. Diamond or Platinum? It'd probably be Platinum. Or mint or... Uru, right? Oh, no? All right. $2 winner's choice. Let's see what we got here. We'll get this one started. Uh, Superman family number 198. Supergirl. We've got Superman family number 211. Why is... Look at those sleeves. That... The, that was really her costume? She had wicked baggy sleeves like that? I do not remember that. Here we go, guys. Tom Sawyer, number seven. Featuring Alice in Wonderland. Uh, some Archie. All right, these, these two are going to go together because they appear to be stuck together and no backing board. What the? F oh, they're just, yeah. 
Uh, tell me it's an innuendo cover. Let's see. I no longer worry about the high price of ass. Uh, just the high price of oats. I, I tried to make it naughty, but it's 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 not working. Let's try this one. Hey, gang, help yourself to some of my... Uh-oh, I think we're in trouble. Okay. those b Both of those will be in the same bundle. Flintstone Kids number two. I want to say if you ever find this game on the Nintendo Entertainment System, you found a very valuable game. Porky Pig. Whitman Comics. <laughs> oh my God. What are you doing? Get it? Because he's like cannibalism. Uncle Scrooge. Number 278. Uncle Scrooge, number 248. Ooh, here's an old one. Uncle Scrooge, number 19. Okay. And uh, yeah, looks like number 299. Love that cover. That's a good one. There we go, guys. Let's start. Let's just do four on this one. An adamantium. There we go. There we go. $2 winner's choice. Let me see if there's anything else I can throw in here. Oh, I don't think there is. Right, I'm going to throw this Justice League in. That one's in there. Um, Really much else to throw in. Looks like that's going to do it for this round. <laughs> Direct market edition. So this can't be that old. Yeah, it's number 299. This is a Gladstone comic. $2 winner's choice. Every book you get gets you a spot on the giveaway wheel, guys. I got the pull box going strong. $5 a pull. Every book is an, an exclusive. You could get some virgin variants. Uh, five bucks a pull gets you not only an awesome pull from the pull box, but it gets you two spots on the giveaway wheel. Uh, and we've got five books we're giving away this evening. Five virgin variants. Got to be in it to win it, though. A great way to get on the pull box. Get some of these winner's choice books. Only two bucks each. Lois Lane, hostage. Got about a minute left on this one if anybody wants to take it to three. Watch out, Superboy. That's deadly liquid kryptonite. Yeah, right in the face. That's not good. It's going to hurt. Phantom of the Opry. Okay. Okay. Bats. Two Archie books in one. No backing board. I'll stick them together, though. Oh, it's good. Wonderful. Flintstone Kids versus the Dragon and the Cyclops. It's a piece of cake. All right, got about 20 seconds left. Looks like PSK is going to take this one uncontested. 
setting the market at two dollars a book he's gonna get every book he wants <laughs> this cover is awful All right, there we go. Let me get the end line down to make it official. Shabap, there we go. There we go. All right, congratulations, PSK, setting the market $2 per book. I don't have letters on them. Just let us know. Just suit the Superman family. It's awesome. Nice and easy. All right, if anybody else wants to claim, just let me know. Got to get the wheel updated. But yeah, Flintstone kids going to James Willie. Two bucks for that one. Awesome, James Willie. That one is yours. Spot on the wheel. All right, if anybody wants to claim these, only two bucks. We've got the Justice League, Porky Pig, Uncle Scrooge. Bunch of different Uncle Scrooge. Got some Tom Sawyer. And two Archie books. Two bucks. Let me know if you want any of those. And thanks for being here, guys. We cannot do this without you. Thank you so much for being here. I got to get some names updated on this wheel. And let's see. I think we've got L Green Machine back in the house. Looks like he's still typing away. All right, why don't we get over and over to Monster Warrior? Let's let Monster Warrior do a round here, and uh, let's see what he's got for us. Monster Warrior, the show is yours, sir. All right. Uh, yeah, this might be my last round with this one, too. So I don't know. a lot early to go to a tournament. So, But uh, I really appreciate you having me on, Beta. Uh, it's been a little bit, and uh, having fun with everybody. So um, I'll go through the, the buy and downs really quick again. And then I'll throw up that Hawk book. But um, 134 and 135, I make grades on these ones. 75 for both of them or best offer. So you got that. You got X-Men 98. Mid-grade on that one. 40. World's Finest, 198. Uh, third Flash and Superman. 60 on that one. X-Men, 100. For 100. This is about an 8-0 or better. Okay. And then quickly, I'll just go through the other buy downs that I had up earlier, just in case since we have a couple new ones. X Men 130. Centerfold is detached on the bottom staple, but it's about a 4 0. Clean and press could really, really help it. 100 on that. Wolverine number one, 8 5 or better on this one. 75 for that. And then Turtles number six. First appearance of Krang. We got $60 on that. All right. Beta, if I may, get a $20 starting bid. All right, $20 starting bid. Don't be afraid to ask questions if anybody's wondering about any of those books that you saw earlier. This is what's going up. Hawk 104. It's intact, it's solid, it's got some spotted wear to it and everything like that, but still a solid, solid book. $20 right now, it's got a little bit of the chipping on the bottom, I'm right there, but yeah, it's a solid book. It's only like the fifth appearance of Rhino, great story of these two fighting. All right, There's here we go, Steven Spock in already at 20. The clock has begun. This auction lot is live.
Well, since it's so quiet, I'm here. It's working. Yes, sir. Awesome, awesome. Good to have awesome. you. Steven Spock in the lead at 20. Now you can put a voice with all the BS that I write. <laughs> <laughs> you might understand some of it better. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I got a weird sense of humor, but I'll hold it back. <laughs> I'm not used to this stuff. I didn't even do speech in high school because I didn't like stage fright. <laughs> Is there music playing? Yes. Yeah, we got a little bit. It's pretty quiet when, when you're on this uh, side. Yeah. The stapler comes in at 25. This is my double. I, I absolutely love this cover and the story for this one. I like the older books like that. The cover is just way better, even than the new ones. No matter how bright you make the new ones, how foily, those right there are the ones that just pow forever. Yep. yep. Especially the Hulk and some of the others. I mean, I know a lot about them, but I know what I like. <laughs> oh, man. Milton Stapler is bowing out. Steven Spock in the lead at 30. We still got a couple minutes on the clock, though, if anybody wants to get in on this one. Feel free to look up uh, online, see what this is going for. I'll see. I think you'll find it's a pretty good deal here. And again, guys, you guys watch the rewind or you're thinking about any of the ones that I have up for the buy it nows. You want to make me an offer? Hit me up. The worst I could say is no. Same with me, people. When I get on there, hey, it's more best offer. I'll make deals. <laughs> We're here to sell books, right? Yep. We got 32 likes, people. If you can help us get up some more, that'd be awesome. Love you. Nice Saturday night. See what happens. Let's get some more if you can. Spread it. Share the news. Tell them there's even a new person on here that probably doesn't even know what he's doing, so you'll get a good price. <laughs> It's weird being on this side after a year and a half watching. <laughs> All right, guys, not thing. much time left. Not much time. Is Steven Spock going to take this one for 30? Pretty good deal. There it is. There it is. Let me get the end line down. Make it official. All right. Shabbat. There it is. Hit me up on IG. Coming right up. Boom. Right there. We'll square up on that one. 
Good pickup on that. Good, good pickup. Discovery got some good books tonight. And uh, Starscream got a steal on the next men book. So, Nolan's got some good ones. But again, if you guys watch Free Wine, you see the buy it nows that I have up and that I've gone through. If you guys want to make me a deal or anything like that, hit me up. Uh, ben, thanks again for having me on. I'll probably be able to. I think I should be able to jump on next Saturday too to meet somebody. Awesome. We'd love to have you. Absolutely, brother. Yeah, because we're on the fourth and the fifth. I got another tournament. But yeah, so um, we'll get through. My, my oldest has prom, and then we'll get through the pictures and stuff like that. And then I'll be able to jump on and, and uh, hang out with everybody again. So awesome. But, um, Thank you very Everybody much. give some love to Monster Warrior in chat. Thank you so much, Monster Warrior, for being here. It's always a pleasure. And Thank yeah, you, guys. Can't wait to see what you got for us next time. There we go. There we go. All right, we're going to get on over to L Green Machine. I had to mute him. He was... L Green Machine's got... He's got a crazy mic, but that's okay. That's okay. He's Sorry new. about that. <laughs> it's a new mic, guys too. Do. Let's give some love to L Green Machine. It's his first auction round here on Auction Comics. Cannot wait to see what he's got. Take it away, sir. The show is yours. All right. I got a few things uh, since I did. I showed up late. I have a pool box. They're uh, three dollar pools. Uh, all this, all these go to my uh, for my first con that I want to go to. It's in uh, August in San Jose, so I'm trying to save up to go to that. So that's all the pool boxes. Three dollars or six for fifteen, I think. Yeah, six for fifteen. So. That all that goes to my uh, fund for that. This now I got just some cover by, by nows. <clears throat> Excuse me. I got Ted of Spider Verse. Let me try it this way. Here we go. Oh, some Scotty Young there. Nice. Yep, for ten. I got. Oh yeah, Star Wars. Huh? Star Wars Revelations number one. For ten. Oops, this way. That's the way I want to do it. For ten. Four best offers. For a twofer. This is Punisher Kills the Marvel Universe. For black cover, but we're on this side. I didn't see any ticks when I got her. That's on the bag, that white. Ten bucks, best offer. And. Spider-Man, Wolverine, Marvel Team-Up, number two. You can see him in the eye of Spider-Man. Nice. Think good. These are all in good shape. It's been going for a year now, buying. Oh, I'm going to grade everything, <laughs> you know, when you first start. Oh, yeah, yeah this is the first. This is also the first appearance of Titanius. A scroll who gained his extreme powers from would be equivalent super soldier serum from the soldier, something like the soldier serum. So that's the first appearance. And then the last one on this one Justice League Incarnate number four, variant cover. These are all brand new. This one is. For sure. <laughs> for 10. And then just you and me now? Yep, just the two of us. Well, just right, well, the two of us. Okay. We're only going to we go can far make it if we try. Just the two of us. <laughs> you and <laughs> we'll probably only do a couple rounds. So. Oh, no worries. No worries. I had enough to just do a few anyway. I got the uh, three page or the three book story from the Spectacular Spider Man. The Death of Tombstone. 
Oh, excellent. Nine, nine zero plus is easy. Like 12 for these. Show you these. Oops, I can't figure that. It gets backwards on my phone. There we go. Twelve for these three. It's the story of Tombstone. All three, so you can just get them all at once. You don't have to worry about just getting one and looking them all. <laughs> Twelve dollars. And then for some Wolverine from Punisher pans, I still have this. These are all I got these for a reason too, because I like to get the stories, and those are what. The storylines are what I'd like to get personally um, created and stuff. I was asking 15 for this. It's uh, Wolverine the Punisher, Damaging Evidence, all three. In excellent shape. Can you see it okay? It's a little pixelated, but these covers are awesome. I think a lot of us know these covers. These are great. My phone doing that. It looks clear on my phone. <laughs> Maybe that's what's wrong. <laughs> I see it now on my other computer. <laughs> on the computer. Here's number three. Whoops. They're all gradable. They probably all get about the same grade. I, I, I'll say nine plus. That's about it. You know, I'm not that good of a grade or anything. But I've learned. So I'd like a 15 for that, and I'm still learning this. Uh, Larry, give me a second here. Uh, I just want to say to chat, if anybody's watching this now or on the replay or whatever, and you're interested in these books, uh, but you're not happy with the video quality of any any of our sellers, let us know. We can take pictures, and you can like do the pinch and zoom thing on Instagram and really get an idea of the quality if, if you have that concern or question about the, the quality of the books. So just let us know. We're, we're happy to take care of you. Uh, I'm gonna do an auction now. Cool. But uh, start at three dollars, and then uh, after every so often, I'll throw in another book. <laughs> These are all X Men Adventures and a couple of X Men Adventure twos. We'll start with the twos. Start with this this one first. Nice. A pack of lips. Yeah. <laughs> Freaking purple Kool-Aid. <laughs> <laughs> These are all really nice grade, too. No ticks or nothing. No pit corners. Did it wrong again. <laughs> It's just the first one. Start this at three. If we get to five, I'll throw another one in. Or if someone wants to, they give me 20 bucks for all one, two, three, six of them. Yeah, I'll show them to you. Here's that, just in case. X is the X Men Adventures 2, number 8, we was doing. Then I had X Men number 4, Adventures 2. Then I had X Men Adventures 13. Cool cover. Oh, this one was a newsstand too. The X Men Adventures Two, number four. Cool. <laughs> then I had X Men Thirteen. We're going to, or eleven. Thirteen to eleven. 
This is a new stand. We're going down. These are the other ones. Someone wants to go all in, 20 bucks. And then number six, this one's a cool one, saber tooth. This was one I was going to send in. I got a few covers with him and saber tooth fighting. And then number two, a rising, a more like rising. And mm -hmm. I know none of them are keys, but they're in awesome shape and. You know, make me an offer, three bucks a piece, 20 for all of them. I started with this one. Probably a three. Let's give it another 30, 40 seconds. Sounds good. Sounds good. We got three eight dollars well, starting just... bid. And... Bid with confidence. Larry Green in the house. Yeah, we get a few few books sold. I was gonna do a slab at a dollar, an X Men slab. If I can sell a few books first, I need to, you know, <laughs> people are interested. I did have a slab ready. I do have a slab. Sorry, man. I'm really nervous tonight for some reason. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. No worries. No worries. There's only 15 people watching. We're fine. Oh, yeah. We... <laughs> We're fine. We're fine. People don't, know, but you, people don't know, but you and me uh, became good friends for a reason. <laughs> <laughs> it worked out in the end. Uh... Yep. All right, so, here yeah. we go. Let's call it. Yeah. Why don't we call it? We'll get the end line down. Yeah, of course, you can do one now if you want. If anybody's interested <laughs> in that, let Larry know. We got his contact information there at the bottom for you. And yeah, let's keep it going. It's not quite midnight. We're going to keep it going. We're going to keep it going. Hey, we've all been there, James Willie. We've all been there. That's for sure. He's got a couple of my books. He just hasn't got them yet. He knows. Nice. nice. <laughs> for people wondering, do you are you going to start boxes for people, or do you prefer that you sh they ship right away? Or if they can pay for it, I can start boxes. Nice, awesome, awesome. So let's see. Oh, it's on my phone. I can't look at it, but I took a picture of what they charge here. <laughs> so a, a I, I can do a I can do a Gemini in the the cardboard, cardboard envelope. It's I think it's nine something. I'm not sure. Yep, and that's then what I the, Then the medium box. If I had two in a large, I think it's cheaper to slip in two of the, uh, use the Gemini on the little ones if it's a big, you know. I'll do whatever's cheapest for you and what we can do. Awesome. Okay, just awesome, pay, awesome, pay for awesome. the books and we'll do the shipping later. All right, we're going to keep it going. We're probably only going to do a few more rounds here. Just, uh, I might do one, maybe two more, um, but uh, Larry's going to do at least one more, maybe maybe two more. We'll see how we do. But uh, yeah, for everybody who purchases from me this evening, you get your name on the giveaway wheel. I've got a number of giveaways that I'll be doing. I've got all these different virgin variants that I'll be giving away this evening. If you want a chance to win one of these books, just make a purchase. Every Buy It Now that you get, for every book in the Buy It Now bundle, you get a spot on the wheel uh for every pull from the pull box you get two spots on the wheel uh for every auction book win if you get three winner's choice books or three books in an auction claim you get three spots on the wheel so lots of good ways to get on the wheel just a way to say thank you for supporting the stream and supporting me as a seller uh jonathan dotson got a book that he already purchased from me we cannot have that so what we're going to do is we're going to take that get him another pull jonathan dotson you're gonna get shabap ult ultimate invasion number one that one is going to you jonathan dotson thank you so much jedo's got books for me before too we went through you remember yes yes exactly yep so he, just, he knows what kind of books out. i got i hope <laughs> he said <laughs> he liked them <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get a let's get an auction going here. We have got 
All right, we're going to do a winner's choice slot. Nice. Awesome, Jonathan. Thank you so much for your support. If anybody wants to get pulls from the pull box, please let me know. We're going to do a $2 winner's choice on this one. $2 winner's choice. These are the option. We've got Batman the Knights, number one in the A slots. Batman Superman 20 B. Scarlet Witch Fried Pie exclusive. This is a bagged comic, sealed comic. It's got a $10 price tag plastered all over it, but you can get it for two right now. Same thing with this man thing. R.L. Stein? Man thing number one, the fried pie, sealed, bagged variant. McFarlane and Liefeld. New Mutants number 93. That one's an option. We've got some cable goodness. Cable 16. PSK is in at two. We've got Captain Marvel number 33. Jim Henson's The Power of the Dark Crystal number 10. But the I think that is still a cool movie. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> well, the special uh, effects back then, it was all well, new, you know? Yeah, well, it was, and it's so realistic because it was real, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was, it was me back then. I mean, like, <laughs> well, the puppets, I mean, the puppets, they were, you know, it wasn't like it was computer generated or animated or anything like that. They were like real pup like puppets. And they were so in Yeah, and he didn't make them all fuzzy, yeah. like. And he didn't make them all fuzzy, like to Kermit and them. He made them actually real looking. Yeah, it was awesome. Uh, Dark I saw them behind the scenes a long time ago. Is the last one. There we go, guys. Three minutes on the clock for this round. $2 winner's choice. The Skeksis. When work and care were put into films, yeah. I can't imagine how long it took to put those puppets together. All right, if anybody wants to get pulls from the pull box, please let me know. Only five bucks each. If you get a pull you don't like, let me know. I'll swap it out. Larry wants to get a play. Oh, Dot Green with an E. Machine. <laughs> Gotta make it legal, right? They're official. Oh, official. Not legal. Official. Two, in, just like everybody else. What did they do to Scarlet Witch, right, Anthony? She looks hungover. I know a guy who collects those that does a uh, show on YouTube and stuff. He gets fried pie variants all the time. Never seen that one, though. Hulk number one. Looks like for... a day after a three day drink. <laughs> <laughs> this is Larry after two drinks. <laughs> <laughs> Six years ago, maybe. <laughs> maybe Hulk she looks one. like that to me now. Yeah. Right on. Hey, you said you wanted the numbers. Damn it. Sorry. I'll let you. That's okay. I saw that Wolverine. All right. Do you? All right. You I saw that Wolverine. Let me pull number three. <laughs> and number seven. Oh, I get to choose, right? Yeah, I'll let you choose. Whichever ones you want. It's late night. You can have the Hulk, the Wolvie, the Dark Crisis, and or the ASM. I'll take all four. Oh, sweet. All right. There you go. <laughs> that was my plan. Just do it that way. way. It's easier. Uh, <laughs> and you get eight spots on the he wheel. You pulled six Wolverines. Uh-oh. <laughs> he accidentally pulled six Wolverines. Oh no! <laughs> I know which book James Willie really wants. I know which book PSK wants. Not that one.
Is that a fold from Patrick Kelly? There it is. Let me get the end line down to make it official. All right. James, Willie, please let us know what claims or what letter or letters you would like. Anybody else can make a claim. There are three each. James Willie. I'm assuming you don't want these. If you, you can claim these if you want them, James, but I'm going to put some El <laughs> Green. Oh, he's taking it. Right? Nope. C, D, D, and H. And H. The Dark Crystal, of course. You got Scarlet Witch's ugly stepsister. <laughs> <laughs> El Green gonna take that one and then James Willie three by three awesome all right remaining books there are not many we've got the Captain Marvel G Cable F uh, Phoenix Resurrected I and Darkwing Duck in the J spot. If anybody wants those three bucks each, just claim them. Each one you get gets you a spot on the wheel. Let me do this now before I forget. Let's get some people on the wheel. We've got L. Green Machine. Now, L. Green Machine got, I can't even spell. <laughs> All right, so one pull. Or I'm sorry, not one pull. One winner's choice. And then one pull. Shit. Two pull. Yeah, four bucks. Three pulls. Four pulls. Bam. Those are your spots. Thank you so much, L Green Machine. Good luck to you, sir. Uh, the real James Willie picked up three books from the winner's choice lot. It's three spots on the wheel. Patrick Kelly gets a spot. And that is going to do it. All right. Perfect. 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 Let me double check. It should have been. Yeah. All right. Good, good, good. All right. The wheel is adjusted and ready to go. It doesn't look like we have any further claims. With that being said, we're going to move it on over back over to Larry L. Green with an e-machine. Take it away, brother. Take as much time as you need. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Oh, people <laughs> check your speed on your computers. It could be right, it could be slow, or it could be just right. All right, well, I know how people like to click newsstands and the other one direct together. Well, I had a couple of Spider Man 99s, 10 bucks, a newsstand and a direct. They got some thingies on, but one of them's. The Rex is better shape. I figured I looked them up and, you know, two for ten or five bucks a piece, I guess, if you want them. And a new stand in the Rex. Choices, choices. I like choices, so uh, it's my turn. I'm going to just give them choices, I guess. Here we go. <laughs> ah. Um, I still have the three dollar pool. Let me pull a couple out and see what you think of them. Uh, all right, I got this out of the pool box if you're interested. Some of them have double books. It's been 99. I think it's in better shape than the <laughs> Spidey. Let's see. Uh, Real Heroes, this is a Pizza Hut. Oh, there's two of them. There's a Pizza Hut. Uh, they used to come with cassettes or something with them. There's this one. He's in the $3 pool. There's another one right there. Captain America. And Daredevil, I think. That's a cool costume. You like Daredevil costumes? 
Don't have this. There you go. Let's have a three dollar pull. Just show you some real quick. Here's Clarion number two. I thought that was the key. Something. Too. Okay. And then what else? Oh, Sleepwalker number two. This is brand new shade. Never been read near mint. And Savage Wolverine number twenty. Then back to that. So that's that's some that's in the pool box. We have a claim. Uh, if you're willing to oh. have any of those get claimed, I assume uh, James Willie saying he wants both the Pizza Huts. All right, they're yours. I'll put them in your box. Uh, let me write that down real quick so I don't forget. I'm even prepared. I got a marker and a real sticky notes. Because the nice. fake ones, the fake I ones know, aren't suck. Those awful? <laughs> oh, I hate them. I hate those fake ones. Yeah, don't use the dollar store ones. <laughs> yeah, they don't stick. They just fall right uh, off. That's you can't even let them make them work. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. Well, I guess. I'll go. You pick them, auction. Give me two minutes, three minutes, or something or less. <laughs> uh, yeah, you pick them. I got in there better. <laughs> so. Uh, I'm going to start them. Uh. I was going to say five, but four dollars. Start them at four. They're all good. Yeah. First one up is a Sensational Spider Man number three. We all kind of keep here to see how that looks. It was a 10 second lag. <laughs> Okay. Deadpool kills the Marvel Universe number five. Batman four eighty two. New stand. Yeah. 28th of July, 92. If you want older DC, I got some of that too. Black Adam variant cut. This is a variant. This is Action Comics 1048. Black Adam was in theaters. <laughs> Not now. It doesn't have a card in it. It just came in a packed mystery thing I got one time. It didn't have a card in it, so it doesn't have a card. I can send a card if I can find a card. <laughs> X Force One. Oh, the new Fifty Two Superman. Amita Junior cover here. Sideways cover. I think CGC and CBCS. Should make a sideways, sideways uh, label for the slabs that are made like this. If you get them graded, how hard would that be? Not very, right? Yeah, they definitely should do that. Absolutely, that would be a cool. That would be a cool option. I'd like to see it on the top, though. Yeah, you know Either what I mean. Way. I'd really the, like where the spine is. I'd like to see. It, yeah, you know, someone with the label on top. Price-wise, though, all they'd have to do is just turn it sideways. It'd save, you know, 
if they just wanted to do it without changing the slabs design at least they could do it that way maybe yep yep oh yeah this is dark cold iron man number one yeah i got this one out of a walmart bag i'm not sure <laughs> i've gotten a couple and then in special crisis crossover Infinity Incorporated with the Star Spangled Kid and Joni Thunder. Joni Thunder Thighs and Adam Joni the Bio Kid. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm going too slow, huh? Uh, Spider Man Double Trouble, Peter Parker, Miles Morales, number four, variant edition. Brand new. And then the last one. Detective Comics starring Batman. Number 554. The first time anywhere. The all new Black Canary. All right. Here we go, guys. You've seen the books. Four dollar yeah. winner. Choice auction lot. This one's live. Let's do it. Two minutes. We've not seen what you want. Tell me what you want. You want new stuff? Virgins? I mean, I have them, but yeah, I mean, <laughs> I can dig. Uh, I don't. I don't know as much about them yet. Working on. It. I got older DC, some different kind of Jack Kirby. Uh, what's that one? I can't think. The Lost, not the Lost, the Boys. That old DC comic. Guys in the sweaters with the pony hair. Off the list between the and there and there. Dang it. Sorry. All right, no worries, no worries. We got a couple minutes left on the clock. Four dollar winner's choice. First come, first serve. Six style, I like the older books like this. See the difference? Way better. <laughs> <laughs> People did that one with a computer, I think. And then you go back to this, you know, it pops too. Just less than a minute on the clock. $4 winner's choice. If anybody wants to start us off, we're getting into the final rounds here. Last minute, $3 a book. Just don't, don't change nothing. $3 a book right now. Last 30 $3. seconds. 30 seconds on the clock. 30 seconds. I'll do this and resume. Try the ramen noodles. <laughs> Oops. Oops. Sweet. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there's the timer. There's the timer. End line coming down. Of course, if you are watching on the replay and you need to see pictures of the books or anything like that, if you have any questions, reach out to Larry. He'll take good care of you. We've got his contact information right there at the bottom of the screen. That's by my name right there is my IG. Awesome, awesome. All right, I think we're going to do one more round and then call it a show. So let me... Uh, 
and uh, we'll, yeah, let's just get right to it, guys. All right, so um, thank you, everybody, who's purchased from me this evening. I've got the wheel all set up. This is going to be your last chance to get on tonight's giveaway wheel. Once the show is over, the wheel is locked, and we spin it five times for five different awesome virgin variants. They could be yours. Just a you know, little extra bonus you can get for, uh, for buying from me tonight. Every book you purchase from me, I've got a winner's choice slot here. Um, so every book you get from the winner's choice slot gives you one spot on the wheel. If you get a pull from the pull box, they're $5 pulls. If you get a pull from the pull box, you get two spots on the wheel. And there's some great pulls in here. We've got virgin variants and uh, every book is an exclusive. Uh, there's trades and virgins in here. All kinds of awesome, awesome books. So last chance tonight to get on that wheel. Just let me know if you want to get pulls from the pull box. And let's take a look at what we've got for the winner's choice. And we'll just do a $2 winner's choice. That works for me. Let's see here. Shabap. All right. Here we have it. Let me get rid of that. All right. All right. Here we go. In the A spot, we've got Immortal Hulk 46. B, Arcade Kings, number three. That looks awesome. Uh, in the C spot, we've got Batman Superman number 17. Cool Clark Kent cover. Nice. Uh, Superman number 28 in the D spot. E is Suicide Squad number nine. F is <laughs> Suicide Squad King Shark number five. This guy looks familiar. I can't see him though. Uh, we got some Suicide Squad King Shark number five as well. Apparently we've got different covers there. Or maybe they're different volumes? I don't know. Uh, we've got Superman, Son of Kal-El, number nine. And last but not least, Superman, Son of Kal-El, number five. There we go, guys. There we go. $2 winner's choice. We got PSK setting the market. He's in it too first, so he's got first pick. Last chance to get in on that giveaway wheel. Let me know if you want to get any pulls from the pull box. Hope everybody's having a great day. Well, at least it didn't rain here today. <laughs> I think you and me are totally opposites. I mean, I'm I think 20 so. miles to the Oregon border. If you, go, yeah, if you go to the California map and run your long finger all the way up to the coast, right to the line, I'm right there. Crescent City, it's on most maps. <laughs> Actually, the latitude line. You know, it goes across the United States. We yep. line up perfectly with New York City. Nice, nice. But here's and here's what's weird: the difference. We're a little town; they're a giant city. Our weather comes off the ocean, so we don't get snow or nothing like that. It doesn't freezes. I mean, we'll have bad weather once in a while. But uh, then you go to New York. Well, the kind of weather they get is because their weather comes across Canada. Gotcha. Ours comes yep. off the ocean. That's that's the end. It's like totally opposite. We're a little town, big city. <laughs> and what did you say the name of the originally city? back little in the town? You said? Our little my town? Little town. Yeah, we're a little town. Little town, nice. Look it up on the internet. It's pretty cool. Great place to vacation. I live in the Giants, the Redwoods. See Bigfoot out there? Nah. I haven't. <laughs> They've done all kinds of movies and stuff up here, so they nice. filmed DT up here. They filmed the school scene here at one of the schools. Uh, like I said before, I don't know if anybody remembers me writing it down. Uh, Return of the Jedi was filmed here. The outside, the redwood scenes, Endor scenes. Yep, yep. Yeah, that's the Ewoks, the little people. Hey, My mom had a little, 
Yeah, my mom had a little snack shack place to sell burgers, stuff in the up in the up by the river where it's nice and warm, or whatever. They go there and get burgers. One time, right. the first time they went in, they said, "Go ahead, I'm sorry." No, no, I was, I was nice. I was listening. Well, your timer went on. Well, the day after they were done filming, me and my twin brother and four other friends. We walked about or hiked up the side of the mountain and got to the seat the day, to where the back door was the day after they all left. It was all caved in and covered up with dirt. <laughs> oh, man. But we dug in about 10 feet. Then it got dangerous, so we stopped. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of particle board. <laughs> You'd be surprised what they make the stuff, the special effects just by painting it. <laughs> All right, Patrick, I think we got you here. We've got I, we've got H, we've got D, we've got C, and A. It's five by two, my friend. All right, five more spots in the wheel for you. I don't want to forget that. E here. All right, one. Two, three, four, five more spots, my friend. Good luck to you. We'll be spinning shortly. If anybody else wants to get in on this, $2 for B, E, F, or G. I'll take it. Yeah. Awesome, awesome. You got it. That one's going to L Green Machine. Thanks. Thank you, my friend. Another spot on the wheel for you. Let me get you on there so I don't forget. There we go. There we go. Fantastic. All right. If anybody else wants to claim, let me know. If you want to get any pulls from the pull box, let me know. All right. I think that's going to do it for me, guys. Thank you so, so much. Let's get on over back or back on over to Larry. Let's see what he's got for the final auction round of the night. Let's give him some love. Take us home. <laughs> well, I was going to say, if anybody's interested in some older stuff, I got like the Dingbats, number one, uh, the, the green team, you know, a couple old ones. And then I got the Captain Glory, Sinister Six, and the Night Glider, Jack Kirby, they all come with cards and everything. Got these if anybody's interested, let me know, but. Uh, I wanted eight dollars a piece on those if anybody wanted them. Um, ah, <laughs> uh, might as well try it. These are all great books. Um, I'll drop it eight dollars and said eight dollars book. Uh, choice. They're not lettered or nothing this time. Sorry. <laughs> How's that sound? Got it. Eight dollar <clears throat> winner's choice. Uh, Pick them. But here we go. What are the yeah. options? First one is. Oh, geez, uh, this is a good one too. Nine eight. It's like going for a hundred some dollars over. Oh, this is a uh, Secret Wars number one variant edition. Oh, it says stuff on the back I wrote. Huh. Premiere issue of a nine issue series, Amanda Connor variant. Secret Wars number nine. This is going to be a hot, hot book pretty soon. When the movie comes out. Uh -huh. The Amazing Spider Man 355. Newsstand. Yeah, no take. Eight dollars for it. Eight dollars for it. Uh. 
the Avengers 363. This thing has no problems with this with this spoil at all. I made sure it looked there. Really close. Oh, the gold one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's the silver one. Oh. Oh, no, yeah, that's a different cover than I was thinking of, and I know how hard those are to keep in nice shape. Yeah, there's a I have a bronze one too. Yeah, this is uh, the silver one. Let me show you this. Show you the spine so you don't freak out. <clears throat> yeah, that is crystal, crystal clear. I was looking on the internet, or. Uh, you know, fee bays and stuff. Five, ten, fifteen ticks, twenty-five dollars. <laughs> I said no, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, next I got. <laughs> was this laying down? It's easier. Mary Jane the Black Cat, number five, the Queen of Heart, Queen of Hearts edition. Uh, new, never read. Here's one people might like. I think it's a wrapper. I'm not really sure. Oh, this is the one in 20 variant. Valiant. <laughs> Quantum plus Woody. Shiny up in here and stuff. Well, shiny <laughs> and this one here here mint mint batman catwoman book one black black label so let's see it's a limited right. series periods in which in lives of bruce wayne and selena kyle past present and future first app of the sewer king Introduced in the animated series. Who? Awesome, awesome. Clock has begun. $8 winner's choice on this one, guys. Lots of different options to pick from. Go ahead and cycle through those books for us, uh, Larry, so we can see what the choices yep. are. First one, put an $8 bid in. We'll get first pick. These are all credible books. That's your thing? Or just great condition books for your collection? New thing. This the one. I want to blind you. This one's nice. I have the uh, different number, two, three sixty-two or something. It just uh, it's got a few ticks on it. I didn't want to put it out there. Our friend Okinawa Jarhead sees something he likes. He's in at eight. All right. This cover is so cool. <laughs> I mean, I like all the Valiant stories and stuff, but some of their covers are right up there. Hopefully next month I can get my own internet. Get, maybe I'll take some of my birthday from one of my sisters. Her birthday's next month, so take You're a little bit. Go get internet the internet right now. I'm calling the cops. Oh no, no, it's on my phone. It's on my phone. I'm, I got the free internet going on my computer, so I can read the. <laughs> nice, nice. Where All I, right, the trail park on that. Yeah, we've got ten seconds left on the clock. 
Okinawa Jarhead. Looks like he's going to set the market at $8 per book. There's the timer. Let me get the end line down to make it official. All right. Okinawa Jarhead has set the market eight bucks a book. Just let us know which book or books you would like. You get first pick. And of course, anybody that wants to make backup claims, you are allowed to pick any books that Okinawa Jarhead does not select. Secret Wars Spider-Man. <laughs> Secret Wars Doctor Doom. That's how you can say it if you want. Oh, both Secret Wars. All right. Nice. First two. Good choice. Hot series. Mm -hmm. Very hot. Let me show you others real quick for you all if you want. Please do. And finally. All right. If anybody wants to get any of the remaining books, it's not too late. Just let us know in chat. Our friend Larry will take good care of you. Ooh. $8. Yeah. So drop it to eight. $10 to eight right here. Well, you get to. Oh, you got the newsstand there as well? <laughs> yeah. Nice. This, see, some people like both. So newsstand and the direct, eight bucks. Spider-Man 99. Nice. There we go. We're gonna I'm I'm planning on doing this every Saturday, this format from now on. It, it hasn't been too bad. And uh you know, we've got a ton of books that we can go through and sell and hang out and chat comics and <coughs> TV and movies and stuff like that. So we always have fun. Hopefully it's not too boring for you. Hopefully everybody had a good time. Huge shout out to Larry L Green Machine for uh for hanging out with us tonight. Hope to have you back again soon, my friend. Anytime. If I can do it, I'll do it. Nice, nice. You're in the chat, so you've got a you've got an invite. Hopefully we'll see you back next week. Now we've got some giveaways to do. It is time, guys. Thank you everybody that has purchased for me this evening. It is time to wrap up the show, but before we go, we're gonna do Thank the you much too, yes. <laughs> Thank you too. Yes, I appreciate it. All right, let's Excuse see me. here. We've got, these are all the names that are on the wheel. Thank you so much to every, let me sort them, just sort them. Thank you to everybody who purchased for me this evening. Anthony Kirby, comic book G-Man, Darth Lucian. Thank you, Darth. Discovery Bay Comics. Thank you for getting those polls. Jonathan Dotson's on there. L. Dot Green with an E machine. <laughs> Lizzie Venus. Thank you. Milton Stapler. Thank you. Thank you. PSK is on there. Thank you, Patrick C. Chris Kelly. And the real James Willie. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, let me go like. Yeah, I guess that's going to have to do it. And then if I go like that, you can still. No, you can't see me. Oh, well, you're going to have to deal with it. All right. We're going to do the juggernaut first, guys. The juggernaut is first. Hmm. Yeah, I kind of like that. Like, yeah, let's do it like that. All right, the Juggernaut is first. Oh, I bet I can make this bigger too. <laughs> All right, there we go. All right, here we go. We're gonna uh, we're gonna do some shuffling, guys. We're gonna shuffle, 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 and spin. Here we go, Juggernaut. Who's gonna get him? Who's taking Jugs home for free? Virgin variant. Thank you so much. Two. Is it Larry? Is it Jonathan? It's Jonathan Batson. One pull from the pull box, one free book. So far, we do remove that one instance. Shabap, Jonathan Dotson, thank you. Next up, looks like we've got the Rogue next. Uh, before we spin this one, I do want to give another shout out to our premium channel members. Guys, thank you so, 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 so much for being a premium channel member you guys don't understand how much it helps with all these giveaways so thank you so much for what you do you guys rock and roll these are awesome 
Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right, let's keep it going. Rogue, who's Rogue going home to? We've got the wheel here. We're going to go shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. And then here we go. Who's going to get her? All right, play it one more time here. This one. <laughs> oh, my God, let's win it again. <laughs> The real James Willie. <laughs> That's right. The real James Willie. I spell it out the whole time, the whole way, every time. Real James Willie. Congratulations. Thank you, my friend. Wolverine is up next. All right, we remove that one and we go. Oh, let me turn this up here a little bit. There we go. Shuffle, shuffle. Wolverine. Come on, Wolverine. Come on, Wolverine. <laughs> hey, it's. Stop! Ah! Yeah, congratulations. <laughs> hey, Blair, congratulations. Wolverine's going home to you, my friend. All right, next up, Captain Britain. Here we go. Captain Britain's going to... Shuffle, 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 and spin. Let's see who it is. Darth Lucian! Congratulations, Darth. Nice work, Darth. Thank you. Free book for you, brother. All right, here we go. Gambit, last one. Let's see where Gambit is going. We're going to shuffle, 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 and spin. Is it Darth? Is it Anthony? Anthony Kirby, thank you so much, my friend. Congratulations. There you go. Congratulations. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right. There we go, guys. I think that's going to do it. Uh, Larry, do you have any, any closing words for us? Good night. <laughs> Try to save. I'll probably see you next Saturday. Awesome, brother. Always a pleasure. Thank you so much, Larry. Thank you to you in chat. Another huge shout out to our premium channel members. And thank you guys for being here. Appreciate it. Thank you, everybody. Buying, bidding, chatting, and lurking. Uh, pretty sure Thanos took this one down. Oh, yeah. The official results, 67%. Thanos takes it down. Thanos advances in the brackets. So make sure you tune in for the next show because it's going to be Red Skull versus Venom. We're going to see who wins that one. Red Skull versus Venom. That'll be the next one. So we hope to see you right here on Auction Comics. I've been your host, Beta Ray Jim. Good night, everyone. Take care. Good night, everyone. Think of me what you will. I've got a little space to fill. So let's get to the point. Let's roll another joint. Let's head on down the road. Somewhere I gotta go, you don't know how it feels.